Oh man, I think it ended the. <laughs> uh, I think I ended it. What did I do there? Oops. Let me send the thing to Leroy. Then we ended that. Oh, goodness me, what did it do? Okay, let's go. I never used it on my phone before, and I hit the button that ended it. Ah, goodness. I kicked everybody out. Am I still in? Is the chat still going? On the last one? I don't even know what's going on here. Hold on. Do I have two stream yards open now? See, now I, get, I got all confused again. Nope, the other one's gone. You see LaMarcus Aldrich to the Nets and Drummond to the Lake Show. I know. Seriously, man. Uh, what are the Warriors going to do? Come on. I don't know if they have any cap room. Do they? Uh, did you get embarrassed? That you hit? And the, yes, I did. I don't know what I hit because I was using my phone and then there's a button there that says end and then I'm like, oh, okay. So I thought I was ending my little segment on the show. And then no, ended the entire thing. I'm like, ah, great. So I think I kicked everybody out. I don't think no, I don't think even Leroy knows about this now. Let's see here. Uh, dose. I need to look that up. Where's Warriors? Let's see here. Let's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think it is. I don't know if Leroy knows yet. I think he thinks I ended it, maybe. Oh, my goodness. This is hilarious.
what can I say? Seems like your picture quality dropped even more from last stream. Did? Ah, oh, man. Hold on. Seriously? What is up with this thing? So I refresh. All right, I'm not going to end. I'm going to refresh this. Hopefully, my picture will get better. All right, is that any better? Oh, oops. Okay. All right. Well, I refreshed it anyway. I, I, that's the thing. I was trying to flip the camera around on my, my cell phone, but you can't do that on StreamYard, I guess. It doesn't let you do that. And then I saw the end button. I'm like, all right, I'm just going to end this. This is annoying. And then I ended the entire thing. I'm like, ah, great. Uh, I'm the least technical person. Funny thing is in my... My wife always jokes about this. My immediate family always asks me to help them fix anything technical, and in my head I'm laughing like I'm going to make the I'm going to make this way worse. I mean I'm not horrible, but I'm not great. Want to make it was traded to Charlotte. I'm liking that Charlotte has the. Uh, you have to go to bike camera and select rear camera or front camera. Oh, because I could do that like normally, but that's within StreamYard. When I clicked on my camera, it just showed my, oh, okay. I didn't think of that. All right. That was annoying. I wonder if, let's see. Let me see. Let me message Leroy again. See if he's, hopefully he's okay. We are live still. I started a new stream. Live. Oops. Nope, not the keys. Statistically, folks are watching porn around this time on Mondays more than any other day. Really? Seriously, that early in a Monday morning? Wow. People, let's just say, like to get their week started on a, what would be a poignant word? Uh, yeah, just get it started, I guess. I don't know. That's hilarious. Heard that on a podcast one time. Well, now we heard it on this show, too. I'm driving to work though, so I said, please say you're not mark partaking, Cameron. I don't want to hear some weird news from <laughs> from the Northwest. I'm kidding. I know you wouldn't. It's the guys that struck out all weekend at the bar. It's letting the frustration. Yeah, seriously, man. But Monday morning? That that seems like way too early for me. You know, like you don't have a drink before 9 a.m. in the morning, that type of thing. Uh, uh -oh, I think we've lost Leroy for good, though. Leroy. That, exactly. Starting the week off with a bang. Where's my bell? Good morning. Good morning. Mr. Lone Star Picker, Gravity Good, yes. I need to check out that Warriors. Let me see. Let's see the NBA trades. NBA trades. NBA trade deadline secret winners. Six players benefiting from the moves their teams made. I'm going to get my raw <laughs> caffeine box off. I'm watching my question. Do you finish? I did not. I did like 50 going now, too.
seen four dog stars in life. <laughs> oh, it's good stuff. I have some Starbucks delivered. Ooh, fancy. Great, now he's <laughs> uh, Let me text him. Okay. I know. What can I say? Ball sack internet. Uber eats, man. Six bucks every tip. Or the man drives 20 minutes. I'll pay all day. There we go. Yeah, we have a Starbucks not quite walking distance away from us. Let's say it's like a 25 minute walk. 20. I wouldn't walk there. I hate tipping, I find it awkward. Yeah, I mean, I'd find it awkward not to tip if somebody, just, I'm at the point now where it's like, I mean, you have to tip at least a little bit. Uh, unless they don't do anything, like if you're picking up, then that's one thing, but if they're doing the dropping off, then 25 minute walk, I'd be at the end of my road. Yeah, I've never, it's we would do this walk from our place all the way down to like there's a walmart there's a starbucks there's a few other like a mcdonald's taco bell it's about a 20 25 minute walk one way exactly tipping is their income so if you if they, they have to do something obviously you know serve you something deliver you something pick up something for you that kind of stuff any of that stuff you got to tip but if i'm picking up that's a different story I think tipping is a lot more common. Yeah, it's a lot more, I don't know what, but um, Europe, it's not really as common. Asia, it's definitely not as common. The US is, it is, it's a lot of times their pay. So that's, that's the main difference. They're not getting money unless you tip. No, England, I didn't, I, I mean, I was a kid when I was in England, but I don't remember tipping was, I don't know if it may be now, because the U.S. influences everybody, but hazelnut mocha, take my fat. Are you in line saying this? I hope you're in line saying this. Please make a video of yourself saying hazelnut mocha, take my five dollars. I freaking hated when people didn't tip when I did Uber. Any time I've taken, yeah, Uber, you got to tip because that's literally that's more than delivery. They're delivering you. So I mean, <laughs> picking up and delivering. I think in the U.S. you pay less than minimum wage for those. Yeah, it's true. That's why, exactly. I mean, it's simple math. They're getting, I mean, some places, who knows what pay other than the tips. And a lot of times they have to split the tips too. That's the thing. Um, one of my first jobs was I was, what, 16. I was a bus boy slash whatever because they wouldn't let me be a waiter until you're 18. They used to split our tips. So I think we got paid minimum wage plus split tips, which were not much. Servers work for less than half minimum wage here and rely on tips. In California, I believe you have to, it has, everything has to be minimum wage at least. But even that, that's not great. I would feel embarrassed if I didn't tip. Yeah, yeah. Especially if you can afford to do it, do it. In the US at least, I can't speak for other countries, but um like especially it's it's tough waiters waitresses bus boys delivery people uber you know yeah i guess we don't really use taxis as much but yeah my buddy got chased by a waitress for his cheap i that happened to one of my friends too they went to sushi this is years ago we were probably like 18 19. they spent like a couple hundred bucks on a dinner and he like the, the boyfriend didn't like, what do you call it? Um, I guess he didn't like the, the way they treated him. 
So he get he left like a dollar tip or something. So they chased him out in the parking lot. They were pulling out and they stopped. They when they were pulling out in the parking lot, they said, "You know what? We work off our tips. Do you mind doing a little bit better or something like that?" Uh, I'm always getting their Americanos because they don't charge for having four shots of espresso. Really, four shots of espresso? My goodness. Then I cream and sugar if needed. Okay. Gordon to Nuggets. He's finally out of Florida, but sadly on Denver. Vic, I'll up to, to Miami. He's cool. Aladipo, Aladipo. That's a cool name, Aladipo. Solid player. Yep. Dubs, Dump, Marquise, Chris. That was good. Buck, Stall, PJ, Tarka. Let's see here. So they're saying the highest ranked trades was Christian Wood, middle all star caliber season, forced to miss over a month. Okay. What happened to Leroy? Does he still not know we're back? I don't think he knows. Focus on the Pittsburgh and Nate yesterday. Jake uploaded a video. Did I get scammed on eBay? I hope not. Uh oh. And it says scammed on his thumbnail, too. It sounds like he did. I'll have to watch that later. What percentage do you tip at a restaurant? It's, I mean, 15% is the bare minimum. Um, uh, I'd say 15 to 18, usually. 20% if they did a fabulous job. Kind of depends on service. Where's your other person? I don't know what happened to Leroy. He was here. It was my mistake. I ended the stream when I thought I was ending my part on the stream and I kicked everybody off. So I hope he doesn't think I kicked him, that it's, we're done. Yep, Jake, Yakov, Yakov. 20% tip because they don't make shit. Exactly, especially where you are, Topher, San Francisco. 24% so it's under 20 bucks and that's it. Yeah, it's all about, you know, do they bring something to you? That's it. Uh, they have, all they have to do is use their hands to bring something to you. If you go to them, pick it up, that's different, but, you know, because just no, I mean, if you guys have ever worked at a, as an Uber driver or as a waiter, waitress, or whatever, you know, they don't pay you that well. I'm always at 20% even when the waitress was shitty. I just feel bad because they don't make, and they might be dividing those tips. That's another thing. I will just put See, my wife's telling me what to tell the the guy that was supposed to do the fence. Okay. I like to leave five dollars when it's under ten bucks because you're a baller. I don't know if I leave five it's if it's under ten, but if I share reseller info, I have forty dollars, two twenties. I've given a hundo for a connection to a big deal. Uh-oh. Big money plays. Big money. Right, where is this guy? Seriously. Can you not? Let's see if we can get him on the phone. Let's see if he picks up or not. Maybe he's on the phone. Maybe I'm bugging him. Hold on. Exactly. If they worked in the industry, 20% minimum. Yeah. Good morning. Is this oh, hold on. Let me call you back. Hello, Mo. Is Mo there? <laughs> Listen, I don't need to explain my personal 
things with no, 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 that. No, no. I was just I making sure you knew. Yeah, yeah no, the I had, But I'm just shush. I I had some I had sort of a little fire that I had to put out really quick. Um, oh. so I apologize to the chat and I apologize to you. I didn't even have time to excuse okay. myself. So I I apologize. I kind of did it for you. So you didn't see what happened? Well, I did. That I came back and I was like, oh man, he's ticked off. I was no, like, what see, that's what doing? I thought. That's the only reason I wanted to let you know because I'm like, wait, he's gonna think I did this on purpose. No, because I did I've never done it on the phone before. And you know the bottom it has the orange button that says end. Yeah. In my stupid brain, I thought it was ending just me. I ended the entire thing. I'm like, oh, oh okay. Yeah, because I because I, I looked at it, I was like, the time doesn't add up. I know I was gone for like 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. I was into the chat, it was like 18 past, and I was like, Oh, okay, Mo will be back soon. I heard you come back. But I was on the phone and I wasn't reacting with these guys, and That's I didn't know if somebody mess if somebody messaged right. you, and then all of a sudden I I so when I heard you when I heard you come back I was like okay good I can go and take care of this, and when I did, and came back you were going going uh, and then like, I'm like what yeah, is going so, on? Hey, there's a way fireworks. <laughs> It's, you know, I'll, I'll force the gasoline to make it worse. So the topic, just so you know, right now is tipping and how, um, what you tip at a restaurant, type of thing. Don't ask me because I'm the wrong guy. I use Amazon Prime now, delivery within two hours or whatever. Wow, I've never used it before, but uh, I always tip $20. Hey, Those Mo, Amazon drivers, I, my I, goodness, um, they get pushed around a lot. Am am I um yes. am I choppy to you? Oh, you froze up there for a sec. So am I frozen or you frozen? Because you look bad on my a end. little bit now. If you want, guys, you go out it, and come back in. Mo, or... Is it Mo or me, guys? I think you're am good. I, now. You're, you're clear. Good you're, now. you're a little. You're, you're better good now. now. Okay. You're good now. Are you, so you're talking about tips. Tips. Wait, waiters, waitresses, Uber. I'm not the guy because I tip way too much. Oh, no. That's what everyone's saying, that you should tip. Yeah. Um, I'm, did if you I ever work in a, a, a restaurant? I'm sorry? Have you ever worked in like a restaurant or like a, a my brother, My brother was, in, was a hotel restaurant manager, so he taught me everything I know. My. So no, that answer is no, but I know the game. Yeah. So, yeah, my first. Oh my goodness, I have some stories. Um, <laughs> most, I'm sorry. Most feds guy did the internet in. I think. <laughs> I think so. I think he's gonna steal the dog once the dog goes to the fence. He's outside with a pair of scissors by the cable box or whatever they have out there. <laughs> well, Mrs. Yeah. Mo will kick their butt. Mrs. I'm afraid of Mrs. Mo. I, from she already texted me. She already texted me already about what to say to him. Um, so that just make sure you tell me, you know, you weren't needed. Oh, wait, what should say? Hold on, let me read this back. Okay, we were unable to get it done yesterday, so we, uh, we got it done. No, we were unable to get it done. So yesterday we found somebody else to get it done for cheaper. I'm not. <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> you can't say that. No, she was she was annoyed because he went when he left, like when she was she was talking and. He kind of didn't really make any eye contact, and he was kind of like, "Well, I'll just be back Wednesday." And that he kind of left, and that kind of rubbed her the wrong way. Like, you know, you can easily look at me, you know, and then just say, "So, I'm probably just going to say, you know what? We ended up having to go. With, we had to get it done by today because he said he can't come back till Wednesday. Mm -hmm. That's my opening. I'm just going to say we had to get it done by Monday, so we had to have somebody else come in. That's it. I yeah. won't say I did it myself. Yeah, yeah. but I'm kind of like then okay. <laughs> Uh, what did I get? There's a couple people I didn't say hello to. What's going on, um, Louis? I see you in there. And what's going on, Eric? I know you were there a little, little while ago. I don't know if you're still around. And I can't read that one. Uh, I know Hol Heidi is in here. Hi, Heidi. Um, there's a couple of you guys I can't 
pronounce your name correctly. So I apologize. That means you're new to me. That's awesome. You're frozen, Mo. What the heck? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I guess I'm still here. So I'm going to keep the ball rolling. Yeah, he, he froze with a nice face. Oh, and hey, guys, what's going on? It's Leroy from uh, Blood, Sweat, and Cell hanging out with um, Mo? Yeah, Whoa. that was me. It's funny. As soon as we say that, my internet just starts the, the black circle. Tommy already thing. said it. Tommy said it. Tommy goes, the, the guy, he's, uh, he got it out for you. Yeah, he does. You hey, you were cheesing. It was funny. You were like, <laughs> and, and everybody was everybody was like, at least he went out with a good smile. Oh, see there, I see it right there. That's a good pose, Mo. Thank you. I I took a picture of that, and I'm gonna put that on. Um, I'm gonna put that on uh, plenty of fish. Oh man, plenty <laughs> of fish. <sighs> I don't know the websites. I found my wife on Christian Mingle. You want me to put you on Christian Mingle? Go for it, man. <laughs> no one's going to want to mingle with me. Like, who's that cheesy guy? I'll put you on Farmer's Almanac. <laughs> Farmer's Almanac. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Of course, yeah. Grinder. <laughs> Oh, so what was I going to say? How do you pronounce her name, the one that said Plenty of Fish? Uh, hold on. Let me go back. Plenty of Fish. Was it Mother's Mustache? Yes. Okay. Because I don't think it's popped up for me yet. You just clicked on it when she said, oh, when she said, um, oh my God, Leroy brought up PM Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. Sorry. Yeah. Like, okay. Gotcha. I thought that's what it said, but I didn't want to say the wrong thing. No worries. Okay, so now I think we're back to normal. Oh, I forgot. I was giving my kids. Oh, I think, I, yeah, no, I put down the breakfast and I came in here. I completely forgot about them. Did you know that I was gone? I saw you leave, so I figured, but then um, I could see why. I mean, I thought that I'd ended everything. So, like, oh, okay, oops. I was, I was scared. I was like, oh, man, he ended the show today. Because uh, I, 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 I had to. I didn't know how to flip the camera. I, I was trying to flip the camera around so you couldn't because I was looking at my big old chubby mug the whole time. So I'm like, no, no, I'm trying to flip. And I'm like, forget this. And I gave but up. My mug's not cut chubby. No, you got a nice skinny mug there. I got my talk about cup. This, this thing is so heavy. It's a Yeti, but it's 32 ounces. But yeah. to me, it's like sometimes, like when you're trying to get your stuff out of the car. And yeah. go from the car to the house, and it's full of coffee. It's like <laughs> I'm a sugar I did baby. List, I did list one thing when you were going. Yes, good job, buddy. So I'm going back. I was, into I was looking up NBA trades. Ah, boy, I think the Warriors are done forever. We're never going to get them. I mean, not that anyone around the country cares about the Golden State Warriors, other than maybe me and Topher. But I used to, I used to like them back in the day. I mean, not really. Like I've heard so many people that I talk to anywhere outside the Bay Area. Actually, even in the Bay Area, there's a bunch of Laker fans. But they were good though. Who did they have? They had a couple of good people back in the day. Oh, I mean, I used. To, I mean, I remember when we were so happy when we made the playoffs, when we had Baron Davis, and, you know, we had Captain Jack, and they made, like, the first, second round of the playoffs. And that was when the We Believe thing started, I think. And then that was, that was like, it, though, first round of the playoffs, second round of the playoffs, max. And then we got killed by the Lakers or killed by somebody. I don't think we even played the Lakers. How many wives do you have, Cameron? Oh, my goodness. Did I miss something? <laughs> Cameron has more than one wife? <laughs> no, he's not, he's not in Utah, apparently. No, he's not in Utah. Does he want mine? Because, I mean, I'm she's available. <laughs> Should we get Moda a 1,000 subs so we can donate for better internet? Yeah. Uh, 
<laughs> Believe me, I've had this fight with Comcast for now. You, because you're totally um, you you have your watch hours, right? I, I mean, I. It's no, I don't yet. I have like twenty. You must be close though. Twenty six, twenty seven hundred, something like that. What do you need? Four thousand. I think four thousand, but I mean, it doesn't really make a difference because. That's just the, I mean, for me, subscribers come hard. I mean, not, not that I, you know, I'm not asking for anything, but I mean. Well, don't you have buy me a coffee now? Now you can take those extra $4 a month and get. Oh, haven't you seen what it says on uh, my, oh, you haven't, well, no, it's a YouTube page. It doesn't say buy me. No, 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 I'm not trying to auction off my wife. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that to you guys. She's free. All right, are we back? I think we're back. Can you hear me? Yes, no. Oh, you muted. Oh, okay. You muted yourself. Okay. All right. No, I said if you go to my YouTube page, it doesn't say buy me a coffee. It says something else. Uh, let, me get the, let me. I'm doing a listing. As soon as I get this listing done, I will. Somebody has to. No, work. you. What is what is this work you speak of? Work. It's called listing. You, it's a listing, live listing. Oh, that's right. Network. I completely forgot about the power line adapters. You know, what? I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna order those power line adapters. Is that the one uh, Tommy was talking about? Yeah, I completely forgot about that. I think he said the Netgear ones, right? I thought Mo was ordering them during that live i thought mo was doing a lot of things during the live guys most of the time i'm just watching old cartoons and stuff in the background that's why i'm giggling you don't even know why i'm like chuckling uh, let's see here tp I'll donate where is it? No, 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 no. Nobody's donating. Anything you donate is gonna go to this guy in South Carolina. He's always like talking about bleeding and stuff. It's not going to me. We should buy me a power line adapter. How about buy me some decent internet? <laughs> let's just before we uh before we get the wife upset, let's just do buy me a fence. <laughs> I'll and work after, with that. Yeah, we'll have we'll have golds. We'll have golds. We'll start off by me a fence. Oh my like goodness, you know, Jennifer! By you, don't me to, you don't have to do that. Uh, all right, now I'm seriously embarrassed. All right, let's see here. Today is Monday, Thursday. What can I get to Leroy in three days? Uh, Nothing. I'm going to be live on. I'm still trying to figure out Thursday. Does your mail come it comes to your home or it comes to your warehouse? It goes to my home. Yeah. Because you shoot what? from the warehouse. I was thinking, if anything, oh, you can't. Oh, okay. I don't have a mailbox here. I don't have a mailbox. I mean, he tires after he tells the guy he's lost the best job. Go fun, Mo. Yeah. Go fun, Mo. I like it. All right. Buy Mo some new internet. Buy me. A she put the link in. I know. <laughs> I'm trying not to look at it. Listen. It doesn't let it doesn't let you check. Oh, I think you got something a little. No, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, just checking. It's a beat. I was. 
I was I was gonna say that. Are you kidding me? Can you? Did you hear that? I hear noises, and I already know what it is. All right, seriously, guys, this is you. All right, I'm all right. Let's see here. Hold on a second, Jennifer, you're in trouble. That's first and foremost, Jennifer, you're in trouble. Second of all, now that you put yourself on blast like that, Jennifer, um, Mo, I know you've probably seen it around, but yeah, um, yeah, but, yeah. You don't have to. You don't have to say. No, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say. Um, yeah. you know, Jennifer hit three years, and that means a lot to me. And so I'm very proud of her um, continuing that journey and doing what's right for her and her kids. Absolutely. So, take that, Jennifer. Right. <laughs> yeah, I hear noises, but we'll talk about it later. Ah, uh, goodness! You guys messed them up. Yeah, let me see. Where is my messages? Because I got a message from somebody. I'm not going to tell Leroy this. Oh wait, I'm is telling it another, you. Is it another hate message? <laughs> the last. Oh, that I... what stupid. No. <laughs> We, not. Yeah, we we're not gonna say. I mean, we probably got a few, but we got one hate message one time. Yes, it was a while back too. I'm like, it was like three people here, and two of them are us. So I mean, <laughs> have you seen that person? All right, all right. Let's see. I got one more thing to write. Let's see. You kidding me? Thank you. People really do want me to get a good internet connection. My goodness. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed right now. All right, after hey, we'll tell your wife that he <laughs> have a new fence. But how that box that Tommy was telling you, um, that yes. box is, is really good. I'm I'm buying it right now, actually. Okay. I just got enough money to do it right now. Are you serious? We'll talk <laughs> after, but are you serious? No. I mean, we'll, we'll I just want to, seriously, thank you. I mean, this is... Uh, I didn't give you nothing. I'm embarrassed. You're lucky you got me. <laughs> I didn't give you... You think you're cheap? <laughs> oh, God. I, here's the here's the thing, okay. Yes. I appreciate everybody what they're doing for you, and for us, not for you. It's for us. The other thing is, I want to hear more stories about your wife, and the the the. I don't want to say it like the wrong way. I only know how to say it one way. So just spit it out. Miss, so Mrs. Mo, please don't take it the wrong way. Yes. But she has that little woman syndrome when yes. she needs to. So like I just I'm just like so she like sort of like she she when he told her he had to leave did she just click it just was like mommy it mommy. was no it was it wasn't it wasn't like angry like I'm in your face kind of angry but it was it was very different she was smart about it but what she did was she turned to me first and then obviously because he said that to me and he didn't look at her I think that's what ticked her off to be honest mm -hmm. if I like. And we're all within like five, like not he was on the other side of the yard, like within like five feet of each other. And then like so she he turned to me and said, you know, I'll have to come back Wednesday. And then he turned away and then he starts packing up. Then she turns to me and then she says something like, Well, you know, why don't we just go to Home Depot and you know, rent a drill? We can do that, right? Something like that. So Yeah. It's because he turned and she told me it's because He's disrespecting me right here. If he hadn't said that, if he would looked at me, had a normal conversation, and it wasn't like she just came out; she was had been there for like a minute. So, 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 and it, so this is what I'm picturing. Yes, this is what I'm picturing. I'm picturing this is Mo right here. You look yes. at me. This is Mo. Yep, yeah. Mo standing there, and his wife going, "Let me at him! Let me at him! I can't! Uh, uh, You're not fixing my fence. What do you mean?" And Mo's just trying to stand there, but. No, I'm just. I'm no, sorry. it was actually it was like he was there, I was on this side, and then she was coming out like the back door, like the patio door, in the backyard coming out. So mm -hmm. it was kind of more like a triangle. 
<laughs> just see, I just see you holding it back, <laughs> swinging it around. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now, see, this is the link. Yeah, this is the link that needs to go up. And don't get pissed off at me, Jennifer. This is the link that needs to go up. Right here. This is for Miss Jennifer Hayes. And and guys, we're not trying to put anybody in spots. Exactly. If you can't do if you can't do for anybody, um, don't do it. Um Yeah. This is not like a free yeah, for all whatever. Yeah, we're not it's not tit for tat over here. No. So it's not at all. Really, yeah. Don't did something for Mo. You don't have to go and do something for somebody else. Yeah. You, take that, you, you can take that five bucks and you give it to your son, your daughter, your wife, your your dog, your fence guy that doesn't show up and do the right work, or uh, whoever. <laughs> but we appreciate Jen. Seriously, so, seriously, yeah. thank you. She um, is she is here, um, guys. She is she keeps us in line. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I got a text message from Jen. Um, when I was away taking care of the business I had to do, and it was, uh, where are you? So she totally keeps us online to make sure that we're, we're, you know, we're doing the show. She enjoys the show. And when we miss it, when we, when we skip Thursdays, she was teed owed. <laughs> it was horrible. She, she was like, what do you mean? So. I think, yeah. Jen is Jen is the boss. It's it's the Mo and Leroy, and we have a, our side, our um, how do you say it? Like a silent partner, it's Jen. <laughs> I'm glad that the first coffee I bought went to a good cause. Uh, thank you so much, Tommy, Cameron, Paul. Really, seriously, thank you. That was. Uh, you didn't have to at all. That was, but you've given me something so I can buy Mr. Leroy. Oh, wait, I didn't say that, but check your mail, buddy. What mail? Mail or mouse? You buy me new internet? Did we both get into that? Goodness gracious, it's awesome. <laughs> um, I'm just getting used to this new flangled thing, the interwebs. I'm, I'm used, I'm, I might actually be able to stay on for more than a few hours here. The, the thing is, it, it and it changes so much, and you got to keep on top of the change. Like, and there's so many ways around it. Like, I was listening to something on YouTube, and the guy still had, he didn't have dial up, but it was almost as bad as that. And his service was excellent. Where he was, he was in a city where there was nothing. No problem. And, he was, and he had something. It wasn't like crazy, stupid money. It was simple. And he was able to bounce off of a couple of things. Though I don't understand how it worked. Yeah, yeah. Um, and he was able to bounce off a couple of things. He did a couple of things and researched a couple of things, and his internet ended up being great. It's like Kat. Kat's internet is tough. She's like in the middle of nowhere. And if they're not going to upgrade it for you, that's the problem. Because you can't. One person can't get it done for themselves. It needs to be an area issue usually. Mm -hmm. Like, um, I've been fighting with both T-Mobile and Comcast, both here and when I was in the Bay Area, which is only about 100 miles away. And for some reason, T-Mobile, they're like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm like, let me cut you off there really fast. You've been saying the same thing for like six years. Mm -hmm. You're like, um, I don't know if you're just not building towers or they're crap or whatever they are. They never work properly. Mm -hmm. Like I said, if anyone tries to call me in this room, half time I have to walk out. Like Leroy says, why are you calling me when, I'm, when you're driving? Well, because if I call them here, after about 30 seconds, the call will probably cut out. Mm -hmm. So it's annoying. It, it's crazy. But I see, I when I moved here, um, so there is a, I forgot what it was. So being, being raised and being growing up in a small, in a big city, like in Rhode Island, um, I never really had that kind of, those kind of issues. I always had service pretty much everywhere I went. Okay. Um, and I forgot what it was. There was a website mo that I looked up, and you can actually see the signal. The you can see the signal. It's a it's a graph. I don't. I wish I knew. 
it was like three years ago I did this, and it was a graft. And you go into this website, you put in a zip code, and it's a graft, and it shows you the internet, not the internet, part, but like the cell phone. It was mainly yeah, for the yeah, cell phone. Yeah. It shows you the cell phone strengths in that area for each carrier. It was okay. it, it, so when I moved here, I did look at that before I moved here. We have three, there's like three towers. There's um there's one here, I think, at the warehouse, and then probably about a half a mile up the road, there is a huge one. So cell phone wise, we we do okay. Yeah. Me, it's kind of hit and miss. Like I said, if I leave the driveway, it starts the internet is it's sketchy. Phone is sketchy. Mm -hmm. So no, literally, like thirty yards in front. Not even thirty yards, but however long the driveway is in front of me, because I'm right in front of the driveway in this office. So not so good. So you weren't around the other day when I was yes. taking pictures. Um, yeah, you were taking care of the kids. So I have a toothbrush motor, not the head or anything. And I was wondering if I was able to list it. It's not, it's just the motor and it's used. Okay. But, but I seen them on there. So I'm going to give it a shot. And if eBay pulls it off, they pull it off. I mean, because it's like a medical type thing. Is that why? It was, it's, I don't know. Like, I don't, I get scared with all that stuff. I got two CPAP machines over here that are worth a good money and I won't list them because I got, yeah, well, that, I got that really can't. I think the yeah. rule is anything that has to have some kind of doctor's approval, mm -hmm. then you got to be call careful. It a prescription. They call it exactly. a prescription. Yeah. Oh, is that what they call it? Okay. Yeah. You and your highfalutin fancy words, man. Prescription. I got to write that one down. I, I only I only ever heard that when I was trying to get Vicodin, but. Uh, I I'll be nice. I won't. That's another story for another day, though. But um, they, they, I heard I heard it is very hard to get Vicodin now. Really, mm -hmm. I mean I'm not joking around about it or anything like that. But it was very easy when I was in high school, college. And oh yeah, know. when I was in the union, man, they used to pass those things around like chicken. exactly right. They would like, and I wasn't even in the union. I'm talking about high school soccer team bus. They're handing them out. Like their TikToks. Yeah, like their TikToks. They used to, I did say TikToks. If you guys heard me correctly, I did yeah. say TikToks. <laughs> I was trying to say TikToks, but I did say TikToks. I'm going to yes. be honest. Yes. But the, well, you should see in the union, it's yes. even worse, Mo. Like a lot yeah. of those guys, even myself, my buddy Mark, yes. like your backs and everything blow out. And these guys, they would, they would sell them like, I mean, there was on every job site. There was probably about five guys that sold Vikes. Vikes oh, selling. Oh yeah, but okay. and they were selling them for like ten dollars a pill. Yeah, you can. I mean, it, you do need it. You need. Yeah, I mean, I, we're not like I said. We're not condoning this or anything. No, 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 no. This no, is no. not a good thing. This is yes. This is what happens. Yeah, and if anybody has have had any issues or issues with it, yeah. we're not. All I'm saying. And I never. To be honest. Was, I, yeah, go ahead. Sorry, it was very easy at a certain. And we all know we're adults here. We yeah. all know that it was very. We're talking easy. about the, like the nineties, two thousands here. I mean, I, it was. I, used to, I I hate saying it. If I need them right now, if I need, if I had an issue and I needed them, I just go to my mom and she'll give me. She has she has a prescription, so she'll give me one or two, and you know, for the weekend to make sure that it's just something that will go away with that. And then if not, then she's like, you know, go to the doctor. Exactly. You know, but I mean, if I but I used to go to her house and I'd be like, Oh, my back hurts so bad or something. She'd be like, Well, I can give you one and if it doesn't go away by Monday, you need to call your doctor. Yeah. I'm pretty sure if I went into the medicine cabinet still, I still probably have some. I mean, but it's been it don't, don't, right ins now. don't Instagram message him because he's not selling them to you. No. <laughs> not no, not at all. It probably expired, and I should toss them out. I I've taken to be honest. I've taken when I tore my ACL. They gave me some, and then I took one, and it made me feel so groggy. I never took it again. Um, it, it 
put you out. Like, like I'm falling asleep here. But, so I like, got really, I got really sick, um, one time because of Viking. I thought I was cool, and I was, I was. It I had, makes you, f it, yeah, it does. Like your stomach kind of goes a little bit, right? I had, I had liquid Viking and didn't know that it's worse than regular Viking. Okay, I and never. Even, you know, a friend the thing. Of mine gave me her liquid Vicodin, and I thought it was cough medicine. So I, you okay. know, I was drinking it like it was cough medicine, and I I passed out. Hmm. I passed. Yikes! Out. You probably had too much of it then. That's well, why I had some beers with it. Oh, that that's a big no no. Yeah, I passed out. It was scary. Oh wait, found a Man United twenty twenty one jersey for a good nice. Oh Ross, yeah. Sometimes Ross marks down their stuff. It's weird. I don't understand Ross and Burling Burlington. Ross, you get stuff for super cheap sometimes, like like the yellow tags, I think they call it. But yeah. Nice. Nice find. You keep Matt grabs the car there and grabs some soma. As an adult now, I believe how it wasn't. Yeah, the nineties, let's just say the rules for certain things were pretty relaxed. Um, that hopefully they don't go back to now because I can see why people have issues with that. So, I mean, it's just, it was too easy to get things. Well, now, I mean, back in the day, if you remember, you didn't need a prescription for antibiotics. Like what they have, like, like, which pretty basic, what do you call it? Z pack? Is that what they call it or whatever? Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't really take those. I, I would just take a Tylenol or ibuprofen or something. And like I said, we are not doctors or whatever. We're just, yeah, whatever. But we don't um, know what we are. Yeah, we're a couple of knuckleheads. But <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, I, all that kind of stuff, you get used to it anyway. So it's probably not a good thing to take anything too much. Farmer's skill companies made everything seem okay in the nice. That's true. Just take something for this and you'll be okay. Just like cigarette companies made everything seem okay. Oh, yeah, back in like the 60s. I don't even remember. Do you ever remember seeing a cigarette commercial on TV? Oh, we were just talking. I'll give him a second. They warned me that the first You said that I remember seeing a cigarette company, what? A cigarette a commercial cigarette. on TV. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was, you know, that was probably like the, maybe the, let me see. When did they take those off air, though? Cigarette commercials TV. When did they take those off the air? I thought they're still on here. <laughs> if it was me, I'm almost gonna say like 2000 and like. No, nah, hmm. I thought it was like the 70s. No way, no way. Maybe really? I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm not talking about the internet. I'm talking about TV, TV. Yeah, TV, TV. I can see why people chase that happy thing. Yeah. I'm a again, again, and I, I hate with that we have to do disclaimers, but again, if you smoke and you're here, we are not. I some people I'd rather see them smoke than do bad yes. drugs. Yes. So what we all have I drink beer. So yeah. we all have some kind of it could be snacks. You could be addicted to candy. I mean everybody has a go to thing. A lot of people like I was. To, I, I'm not gonna say names, but I was talking to some people um, not too long ago, and they were saying like some people drink a lot of soda, some people um, drink a lot of coffee. I only have one cup a day usually. I'll have this one cup a day. Sometimes I don't even finish it, um, and it's not the caffeine. I think I, I'm addicted to like sugar. Yes, I like sugar. Like anything yeah. sweet, any sugar, and then I like to have my beers. I think that's all of us. We're all addicted to sugar. And sugar, I think there's a natural part in your brain or whatever. You get that natural. I mean, it's not a good thing. I have way too much of it. Like at Costco, I found these bars called the Bueno Bars. Oh, my goodness. They're made by Nutella, I think they are. Is any, am I the only one that's tried these recently? The same people that make those, uh, those egg things, too. Those things are so – those are like – very addictive for me at least what did he say Mo? we what? need flea market content soon oh Falsam. 
Yeah, I haven't been there yet. I, I haven't gone there. It's Falls City. Been, where, what season. is the flea market? Like a swap meet? Yeah, no, I never heard of that. Is what do you do there? Yeah, I could show you because I go there. I set up on Saturdays. I have my tools. They're all laid out there, and then you know I do pretty good. Uh, I'll send you an Instagram video. When your brother comes in town, have him help you with the computer. I mean, the phone. I will. I will. He's, co he's coming down from Rhode Island. We're going to, like, you know. He's going to help you set everything up and then. Yeah, exactly. Companies make everything seem okay. Yeah, exactly. It's always about money. Any problem, I'd say 99% of the time, follow the money, and then you got your answer. Mountain Dew doesn't do anything for me. I don't see it being as energy booster but sugar makes the best. Yes, you are right, Paul. Yeah, I mean, Mountain Dew has a ton of, I, of caffeine. I, in used to, I used to drink a ton of Mountain Dew because they used to say if you drink Mountain Dew, it will stunt your growth and you won't have kids. Man, I drank that like it was TikTok. <laughs> so you could be like eight feet tall if you didn't drink that much? <laughs> I used to drink Mountain Dew. And the other thing really bad that I used to have, and they yes. said it was very bad for you, and it might catch up to me, I keep saying it. If I didn't have hundreds of Slim Jims in my life, I didn't have any. I mean, there was a, when I was in the landscaping business, I would have like three or four a day. And I know it's bad. I know it's bad. Slim Jims, they don't taste that good. It's it's all like cow, um, cow and and pig lard. Uh, and, I don't think there's any cow or pig in there. Just to break, hate to break it to you. Um, there's some alien cow or pig or something. It's more, who knows what the hell it is. It says that it's beef jerky. It tastes like rubber. No, they say it's that. It's like you could stretch it. There's no way. That stuff is that stuff is so good for you. The, the, the protein in those things and the calories. If those you look at it closely, they spell protein with a couple extra E's and N's. There's and no <laughs> <laughs> there's no fat content in those there's no fat content because there's no it's, <laughs> it's like synthetic rubber plastic w mm. with brown coloring I mean, uh, beef flavor <laughs> you know what it says beef it doesn't say beef it says beef flavored pork flavored then you're no, oh, like wait a second what what do you mean flavor they sprinkle it on. If you have to sprinkle flavor on, then it's it's not the real thing. I judge no one. It's not the real thing. Oh, I'm sorry. Slim Jims are the part of a healthy diet. Okay, yeah. I, disclaimer time. I was, kid, I was kidding. Slim Jims are disgusting. But, um, ooh. Nice ribs. You got yeah. any left? Uh, yeah, there's some left. Those are the ribs I made yesterday. Nice. And that was before they were cooked. Nice. And that was my first time making ribs. Howdy, Tim. How's it going? Don't you shop for fleas at the flea market? Yes, we do. No, they don't get on the tools. I'm lucky. Yeah. Oh, so I didn't tell you. So I went, I went to do some stuff for my mentors on um, Saturday. And when I left Saturday, I stopped by the flea market really quick. I was going to walk around, but it was packed, and I saw some tables were empty. So I ran inside and to see if I can get tables. So there's a couple of tables that I like, and they were yes. available. So yes. I sat up for two hours, and I made like 130 bucks in two hours. I killed the game. Nice. And then I went and bought Bianca Fruits and uh and um ribs <laughs> fruits and ribs did you say yeah we bought um that's some, a good combo yeah we bought some um grapes and strawberries and raspberries and um i was like what meat do you want you want fish he said daddy i want ribs and i'm like i don't know how to cook ribs well youtube taught me <laughs> They came out good. The flavor was amazing. I think they were not, not bad. They weren't like pull apart. They weren't, they were boneless. They yeah. weren't like pull apart, like fall apart, um, soft, like tender. Um, you did have to cut them a little bit. 
So I think I could have made them a little more tender. Yeah, yeah. But they, you know, they went like hockey puck. Okay. So tender is soft, right? Or is tender yes. hard? I get confused. Which one is hard? Hard is not tender. Tender is soft. Okay. Okay. So yeah. This is when we teach Leroy how to, to speak properly. Hooked on phonics didn't work for me, guys. Hmm. Hey, Mo. Yes. Have you watched any of the uh, five things that these that they used for the raf for the auction? I have. I haven't watched since like Sunday, so no, I have so not seen they, that. Yeah, so now they they all listed their five things that were picked. I didn't no, get to okay. see Tim's. I need to, wa- I need to go back. Actually, that's a good thing. I need to go back and watch that right now. Yeah, I didn't get to see Tim's, but I got to see a few other people's. We go back and watch that. And I'm sorry, there's just so many people. I'm only able to watch, like, I keep saying our people, but the yeah. people that I'm sort of familiar with, there's 30 people, and I can't watch 30 videos. I just don't have the time. It's hard, but I'm sure you guys are doing awesome. I wonder who's going to win, though. That's the big question. I don't care who wins. I'm, I'm never, like, if I win or lose, I'm not, like, that guy that I You have guys to. are all winners in my book. Believe it that. Yeah, I'm too, yeah, I'm too embarrassed yeah. to even sign up. Yeah, you guys are winners. I want to go home and watch NASCAR today. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> so the, they 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 running on dirt, and I like dirt racing. But NASCAR is running on dirt, and they canceled yesterday because of the rain. Ah. So today at one o'clock, the trucks are gonna go, and then at four o'clock. The cars are gonna go. Wait, they have NASCAR trucks? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Oh wow, I didn't even know that. Mm. You ever watch Formula One? I don't like Formula One. I have, but I don't like Formula One. So I don't know much about cars. So the way I've justified in my head is like NASCAR is like the short race and Formula One is like the long race. You see you see um you see there's an honest guy in the chat and he said, Yeah, my stuff is not doing well. Tim, I like the idea that you're that you're being honest. It's because Tim is like the refined seller. But he's honest, yeah. though. He's not yeah. bull crap and like he's just maybe um, hopefully I hope and pray that it, like at the end it all everybody makes at least their money. No, people are, hopefully they'll just at the last second all of a sudden you get a bunch. I mean, most likely I'll make profit, but not nearly as much as I could have just straight up sold the items. Yeah. I hope that's not the case. I hope you end up selling for well over. Most likely Paul, not. message me. Um, Paul, message me on Instagram. I didn't know you know anything about NASCAR. I, I know stuff about me. When you think, why do you think I don't know anything about NASCAR? You, what do you know about them, Mo? Like, that's the, the real um, question in life. It, it starts with an N. It's spelled N-A-S-C-A-R. Um, there's a car in there. They drive around the track. Um, yeah, that's about it. But do you know anything about like what do you like? What do you what's your claim to fame? Like, what do you think you're good at? I can tell you some things I think I'm good at, and I hate saying that I'm good at stuff. <sighs> what's my claim to fame? Since I'm not famous, I guess I don't have a claim to fame, but um, I'm trying to think here, I'll have to get back to you on that one. Jury's still out. Like everything else that he does on the show, he'll get back to us. Not fucking surprised. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Potty mouth. Where's the soap and water? <sighs> what are you doing? <laughs> Uh, hey, you, I, you guys have to admit, you guys see me list, you see me ship stuff. Yes. I'm very persistent, consistent on yes. I sell tools. Yes. You, you can't say that Leroy, that Leroy doesn't sell tools because everything I show you guys is tools. I showed you I found a tool the other day, right? Yeah, I saw and I saw that and I liked it. Did you buy it? No, I didn't. I stole it. I told you what it was. It's, it was for fire hydrants. I did walk out the store with it, though. This thingy right here? Hold on. I, I don't have the camera on. Uh, oh, you did get it. So listen. So listen. I promise you that it's for a fire hydrant. So see that end right there? And I don't yes. even know this. But see that end right there? That yes. end is for the big pot for the hose. Now slide okay. your hand over to the other side. The other side. Other way. Other way. Other way. Nope. Back the other way now. Oh. Move your hand. Oh, my God. I'm going to kill him. Go that way. The other way. I want to see the little right. end. You're always trying to hide the big, the little end. Just show the big end once in a while, Mo. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's cool. I'm going to look that up right now because I think this. this I can't is see. I know, what, I know what I got list. That this is what gets me excited. Don't bring tools on the show. You can't do that. So can I run outside and open the fire engine? That's why I got this. Yes, you can. I'm telling you right now. I I'm don't even know. It. I'm not even hundred percent sure, but my heart and my gut is telling yes. me I know what that is. Right, this is what I'm gonna do. And when it gets a little bit hotter in the middle of summer. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes. Fire hydrant wrench. Did you hear that? Yes. Okay. Bam. Tw same one you got. Twenty-seven bucks. For All right. This cost me fifty percent off that right there. Twenty twenty-seven bucks. Uh, there's one that just sold. Same exact one that you have. I knew I was right. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. I know my tools. I love my tools. So, so that, if you sell for twenty-seven, I'm putting mine up for fifty-four dollars. That is a vintage, but. It was a bid, so they screwed up. So it's worth thirty-five. So it's a it's a vintage fire hydrant multi-tool water utility valve wrench key. They they just put all the words in. That's this thing is it. heavy too. It's that's here's it. another one. Here's another one. It's sold for twenty. Yeah, that red one, that twenty-seven dollars of bids is is nearly exactly the same one. Yeah, here's another one. Fifteen. Do not put it in auction. I'm going to tell I you. I don't really do auctions. Nope. Don't put it in auctions and put it on for 35 All right. Ooh. Oh, my God. Look at the. Oh, snap. 11 and a half inch one, 90 bucks or whatever. No. It's a vintage F E. No, W F E. Hold on. I'm not. Oh, my Jesus. Uh, it's a fire. Hand, uh, I can't even talk. I'm excited. It's $160. Vintage WFE Co. Brass Fire Hydrant Wrench Spanner Tool. You have one of those? No, there's one listed for, and then there's another one. And the guy has red backgrounds. Yes. He's stealing your thing. Yep. Red backgrounds, and he's in California. He's in California. <laughs> It's, it's Tofa. It's Tofa. Where's Mira Loma? He's in Mira Loma. See? See? Here's the same one you got right here. Use this listing, Mo. It's a fire hydrant wrench, one and a half cast iron red combination. For, oh my God, I can read. <laughs> Firefighter shut off. Shut. Let's see, now I messed myself up. Shut on off tool. It sold for $59. List that puppy. Yes, I knew it looked old, but if I list it, then how am I going to, I was planning to do a show in the middle of summer where I run out and turn it on and then like run around in the water. Yeah, I mean, you could do that too. Big, big time YouTube. That, the, the YouTubes love that, right? So so let's, hey, the, we used to do that in the hood and they still do it, you know. They, in I, South Providence, in South Providence in the ghetto, 
when yeah. it's hot, the fire department, they, so my uncles and grandfather, my uncles, my grandfather, ah, yes. my uncles, my uncles used to go and open them up for us. And what they did was they would open them up with a monkey wrench, right? And when it's 90 degrees out and you get a tire and you put the tire around the hydrant at the, the hose and it sprays. Nice. And all the little kids in the neighborhood we all used to run and play and ride our bikes through and cars would go through and beep the horns. Yeah. And now when you go to, to the hood, it, they, the fire department does it themselves. Now they, they call, they call it, um, there's a, they have a program for it. They actually have funding for it and they have a program for, um, where they'll, they'll let you know fire hydrant eight, seven, three, and they call it draining the system, but mm. it's really to, so people don't go do it. It's done normal. It's done, you know, with control. Yes. So everybody's not going around doing it. It's done with control. Okay. So then um, you can't you, have that giant fifty foot spray of water anymore. Then. Yeah. Do you? Did you see the? Um. Do you want me to sit, take a picture of this listing so you? I so think you, I'm looking at the same one you did. Was uh, it eight? Fire. Is it? Was it sold on uh, May 18th? March 18th? Uh, no, I'm looking at a different one. Then. It's $59. There's a little fire hydrant above it. He even sold a fire hydrant? No. Listen, the, those fire hydrants are... If you go to a yard sale and you see a, a the heaviest the heaviest can be, if you see a fire hydrant, those are very, very expensive. That's... I mean, how would you even move that thing? You, you get a buddy and you put it in your car because my buddy bought my buddy. We used to get them from the union. So but aren't they would, federal property or no? when we would do certain construction jobs, they, they would, they would have to take them. They would take them out. So they would do everything over. And the fire hydrant was always the last thing to move because they had to get permission that okay. it wasn't going back to the city town or the place that bought it. Okay. And, we would always put it aside behind the trailer and then they, we would get a machine and put it in the car. There was a carpenter that was selling them for like $500 a piece. Yikes. That's crazy. So what is, hold on, what's uh, Paul saying? Is Leroy getting excited over the big or the little hand? <laughs> it's just tools. It is just, you can't talk about tools with me. Oh my God! There's another one of those wrenches, vintage brass hydrant wrench spanner fire department hose tool L A County F D six four five. How the hell they fit all that in there? I don't know, but I can't normally read how to put water into a oodles and noodles. And when it comes to tools, my my reading becomes a lot better. <laughs> Four hundred and five dollars. If you guys ever see a small hammer, it looks like a hammer, but it's actually for man. Buy that. Send it to me. My mailing address is two seven eight four nine three, what you call it Avenue, in Spartanburg, um, South Carolina. Sounds good. All right, so I bought something. You might sell then. Might sell. That's gonna sell. I think you should just send it to me. I, All right, I'll send it to you. I don't think it's worth shiznock. I think you should just send it to you. Shiznock. What did Jennifer say? I found a fire hydrant for fifty dollars and an estate sale during half day when I went to when I went to ask someone about it. I can't read the rest. Oh, this is another person swooped in and picked it up. Oh. Jen, yes. Jen, you look like you're like a feisty lady. Like next time, hit him. Yeah, and just say Leroy. We don't condone condone drugs or anything on this show, but hit him. So we condone <laughs> violence. Yeah, we can condone violence. <laughs> hit him. If if somebody takes it on you uh, next time, you hit him. You say Leroy said so. Say I got a boy, Leroy. He's six foot and he's six foot and a half inch. He's from Spottenburg, South Carolina. He said, if you take my fire hydrant, I'm going to hit you. All right, calm down. Okay. It's okay. Hilarious. 
I need <laughs> she said, but officer, Leroy gave me permission. Uh, I'm sending you this ranch, Leroy. I'm no, no, you saw that's 50 bucks, man. That that will cover the that will cover the um that will cover the what do you call it? That will cover the 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 free money you're giving the fence guy that didn't do his job. That reminds me I need to tax. Where's him. my bell? Where's my bell? Ding! I got the bell back until my daughter hears it and she steals it back again. Is that what happens? Yes. She comes and takes it because after I leave here, she, once she's done with school, she plays Roblox and she sits here and she's playing and then she turns, she has like her pink pillow and her whatever else. And then if I come to the room, she hisses at me and I have to leave. But what can I say? Did you say she hisses at you? She hisses at me. Yeah, she'll turn and just hiss. Because I'll say, oh, what are you doing? Or I'll say something like, hey, nice to meet you. And she'll say, you already know who I am. It's not funny. I'm like, all right, whatever. So what I do is I jump on when my daughter's on roadblocks. She's at the house now. So yes. what I do is I... I I'm a jerk, and her friends can hear her, and they'll be like, "Bianca, is that your dad?" Because I'll go behind her, be like, "Go, go, go, run, 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 get him, get him, go, go to the left, go to the left, go to the left." <laughs> she gets so mad. I only have one coffee, guys. Hey, there he is. Oh man, hey Derek, how's it going, man? You never guess what message I just got. Uh oh. Text message, need a larger hammer drill. We'll finish on Wednesday. Oh, damn it. So let me message him. Well, I got your message. I got your, let me send him a message. I'll send him a message. Say thank you. Well, let's prep, let's walk you through this, Mo. Let's walk you through this. I hate confrontation. Let's walk right. you through let's, let's walk Mo through this. Uh, this is how I would do it. All right. Okay. I would say thank you for messaging me back. At this time, I no longer need your services. It was sort of a, an emergency issue that we needed to get done, and we had to pursue it ourselves. Yeah. Sorry for, sorry for the inconvenience. How would you like to handle this? And leave it yeah. at that. Don't say you're going to give him anything. See what he says. Just like you do on eBay, if he says, well, I only need $50 for my time. But like, well, you didn't do the job that I needed you to do. It cost me more money. So how about I give you 30? You, yeah. you know, you're, you're a professional. You, this is what you yeah. do. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to do it. I, was, I, would, I mean, I didn't want to – I try and – whenever I talk to people, I try and do between 9 and 5 to respect their time. That's what I was waiting for. I was waiting for 9 o'clock. It's 8.40 my time. Yeah. So I don't, like, text them in the morning. Hey, we don't need you. You know what I mean? Well, I would do exactly what I – I mean, don't do yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, I, I think, think what I said was exactly good, you know. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that right now. What's going on, Joe Deals? How are you? And um, I saw you. I saw what you sent out, and I saw it before you showed me. But um, yeah. Derek has been really working on his exercising, huh? Yes, man, he was beasting it up. And then he, yeah, he did all the exercising, and then he went and he got some baseball cards. Yep, Derek's a true uh, Renaissance man. He's all over the place. Yep. He's down south. I don't know if he's back in. I don't know. Is Derek, Derek, are you back in the Sacramento area now or not? He was did in he, LA two days I know ago. They were talking about on the show. Derek, did you meet? Um, did you meet? Um, did you Kelly meet Lewis? Julian yet? Did you meet Julian yet? Because I know Julian was going up, and I want to say I know you were going to go and see him. Did you guys get to meet up yet? See, I'm feeling hella buff. There you go. Oh, that stinks. But that that stinks. One day, one day you'll meet me, Derek. Uh, when when I go on the Leroy World Tour to the West, I'm doing an East Coast tour, you know, soon, Mo. 
Oh, he's he's busy, guys. He's texting the guy. Listen, mother beep 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 beep. You didn't I'm trying to word it in a way because I've he's not like a jerk. He's a nice guy. So I mean I, here's the deal. Here's the deal. Yeah. Would he want the message from you or would he want the message from your wife? No, definitely. No, 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 I don't wanna uh, you know, yeah, I don't want that. Oh, Jillian was not able to make it. Did you hear uh, Jennifer's on the bottom? Jennifer said, you want me to call him for you? No, we don't want you to call Jen. <sighs> I just don't like telling people, like, turn, like telling me, oh, I don't need you anymore or whatever. It's not. He told, he, hey, how quick tell you he couldn't finish the job? Fast. Fast. And he was packing up. Yeah. I think that's what annoyed my wife is that he's kind of like, uh, well, okay, we can't. and it's like grabbing his bag right there. But I mean, he didn't say it. He wasn't rude. He doesn't have a rude tone. He's not a, like a jerk. So, but they. But he didn't even figure out another option. His option no, was. No, his no, option I, I was he I did try and get on the phone right before that, and then call like local places to get into the hammer drill. But like he did or he didn't. No, I'm sorry. He did or he didn't. He tried to. He didn't. He got on the phone and he said, "Okay, what's the local?" like Home Depot to hear what's the, he was asking me about the street names. And I, I was telling him, he said, well, that's going to take me no, 20 minutes to get up there, 20 minutes to get back. I'm going to have to do this on Wednesday. So he did make the call. And then, like, <laughs> there we go. There we go. Did you finish the text? Because I don't want to. No, I didn't. Uh, right. keep, go with the text, guys. All right. Oh, um, oh. Chris. His name's Chris. Hey, Chris, uh, this is Leroy Blood from Blood, Sweat, and Cell down here in Spottenburg, South Carolina. Hey, hold on. I, I missed the first part there. And uh, I, just slower. Want, I just wanted to um, talk to you about the offense you're supposed to do for uh, my bro, Mo. Yes. Oh, you finished the job. Okay. When are you going to go back to do the right job? Oh you, oh, you don't have the right tools. Yeah, get a better career then. Bye. Took care of him. Sick of it. Ready. Oh, Mo just texted me. He said we're still live. Sent you, 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 you a new link on IG. I missed a call from Mo. I'm blaming, I'm blaming on, you know, I, I found a better excuse. I'm blaming on the adoption people. Guys, we're really, don't lie. Just tell me. I'm, I'm not lying. We'll okay. do the exact story to say. I know. I am saying that. But I'm throwing yeah. in don't, the adoption don't, people to come in and see. No, you don't have to go that far. It was an emergency. You needed it done when you needed it done. Yes. You couldn't do it, so we did it ourselves. Have a good day. <laughs> I apologize for your inconvenience. How would you like to handle this? Well, I would like $50 for my services. Well, I'm only giving you $25 for your services. Have a great day, mother. <laughs> Don't let me get Derek over there. Derek's not far from you. How do you think Derek would handle it? I think I, I think Derek would handle it. I don't think the guy would have left Derek. He would have finished the job. He would have been like, uh, okay, let me just finish it. And then he would have leave. So you're a pushover. You haven't figured that out already? Sometimes, not always. It depends. Okay, this is how bad it is. The guy has met me before. He knows my name is Mo. But I guess for whatever reason, when he was leaving yesterday, he's all, are you going to pay me or is Mo going to pay me? I just looked at him like, uh, 
Okay, and I never corrected him. So oh, he's no, when he's leaving, he said, "You're gonna pay me, or is Mo gonna pay me?" Buddy, you didn't even do the job. <laughs> you, you, no, nobody's paying you. <laughs> oh, let me call. So, up. Let me call. No, him. So, no but the, the the whole point is he doesn't even wait. He was here. He's he came and did, did work for us before like a year ago, and like I've texted him, and I don't have another name, so I don't know who he thinks I am. Maybe I should have. My, no, my my name's Leroy. So yeah, you don't want to meet me. <laughs> no, but the funny part is like I don't oh, know. Who Derek, I was. Derek said, "Hell no, I can't be Mo for you." <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Mo, Derek, he's getting flim flammed by a contractor. And well, the contractor didn't finish the job, and he's afraid to tell the contractor he don't need him no more. Thank I'm you. Not, I'm not afraid to tell. I'm just not sure how to word it correctly, but I got it. I Thank give you God. the ghettoest way, the most front way to say it, and you and you wrote one thing out of the nineteen things. All, right. all right, no, all right. I'm gonna edit. I'm gonna write what you said. I think that's a professional way. Just hey, listen, you know. If, we really, it was an emergency. We needed it done. You want to put shelter in, fine. It was an emergency. We needed it done to prove to the animal shelter that we had it done. You couldn't do it in our time frame. We decided to do it ourselves. Sorry for the inconvenience. How would you like to handle this? And he's going to say, I need $50 or $100 for my time. Whatever he throws you at a price, you go, you cut in like you do on YouTube. I mean, on eBay. Cut in half the price and see if he'll. No, 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 no. I'll give him like 50 bucks. No, 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 you're not. No, you're not. You're going to, you're going to offer him. If he offers you 50, you he didn't do junk. He didn't do nothing. He didn't even get there and do no. nothing. So That's at true. least try to, if, if he says 50, at least try to say $30 and see what he says. And if he says, no, I can't do that. Or, this is a business of trying to make a living. You give him the $50, but you did give it an attempt. I'm tired of this show already. I'm done today. Okay, I reworded it. Hold on. I said, thanks for coming out. Let me see what I say. Okay, thanks for coming out. Hey, Chris, thanks so much for coming out. We ended up having to put up something ourselves because the adoption people are coming out today to look at the property. Done. Okay. And then what? So see what he says. And if he, if he says, I still need a payment, then you cut him in half on his payment and you call it a day. I hope, you know, then you can kiss his butt after and say, I hope we can work together again. I know it was a messed up situation, but thank you for your services. You suck. Yeah. I think he's, you know what, to be honest, I think what he's going to charge for is the drill bit. Because the one thing I did notice is when he came in, he's going to, he, it was unpacking it, like the little, like the, the five That's eights, not whatever. That's problem. That's not your problem. That's true. He didn't he, say it. That's true. That's true. He offered to do the job. He was supposed to have the equipment to do the job. Oh, you sound exactly like my wife. He's like, he's done. He, she even said, you know, he's left now. You know, he's SL, SOL. So. <laughs> Topher and Jennifer, Topher and Jennifer said, give him $5. <laughs> <laughs> I'm offering 30. They say give him five dollars, tap him in the butt and say good game. Here's the thing. I found out where to get the drill from him. Because he said, Where do you go to get it? And he said, Oh, like, oh, like, there's a place. Um, okay, that home depot. And he gave me the address of the Home Depot. And he said, Oh, it's gonna take an hour to get there, an hour. I drove up there. It only took me about, took me about 30 minutes. Okay, so you took your time to drive up there. I went you up there and I got the drill he didn't want to get. Yep, and you pick because he didn't want to pay for all that. And you paid, you probably. Oh, he was going to charge me for it too. That's yeah. another reason. As soon as he left, my wife Listen, said, no, you're not, you're not, you're not paying for that. Stop, stop, yes, stop. Yes, 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 yes. You're yes. getting me frustrated. Yes. You you texted him. Did you send him that? Yes. Oh, wait, okay. no, I didn't send, send him. Hold on. Hit send. Wait to see what he says financially. Okay. Don't say anything financially. No. If okay. he does, you explain. No, 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 to no him. I'm not. I didn't end up having to put. Uh, if he does, money. explain to him what you had, you tell him, listen. If he says, I still need money, you offer him half and explain to him. I had to go out of my way and cancel plans to do this job that I needed you to do. That's it. And we're going to call, I'm gonna call my things. people down. Jen's coming down. Leroy's coming down. Tofa's coming up. <laughs> Derek's coming up. And we'll shake him. Because I, you don't want me to call Anthony and Tony. 
Yeah, I'm just, I, I ended it with, uh, yeah, Should I, let me see here. So I, I just ended it with thanks so much. I shouldn't say let me know how much I owe you or anything like that. No, no, he's going to come back. Trust me. Should I say anything, though, about that? No, or? wait, you didn't say anything wrong. He's He'll come back with something. So just wait. You didn't say I'm not paying you for your services. No, no, no. I just said, you know, the, the, the people couldn't wait. They're coming down today. Thanks so much for your help. What help? I'm being nice. I mean, what else am I supposed to say? What, 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 so what, what do you help you? He you told you all to go to Home Depot by yourself and put your big boy pants on? Well, actually, I told him which Home Depot to go to. But he asked me which I'm one. I'm tired of you. I'm <laughs> tired of you already. <laughs> <laughs> <That's all fun>. <laughs> 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 I'm not even going to repeat that. I'm going to let him read it, Tofa. What did I say? You got Derek and Jill. Oh, Jill it sounds, that basically sounded like what my wife wanted me to say. <laughs> it's not the love. No. <laughs> Jen said it's not a love note, Mo. I know. I just feel all right. Done. <laughs> this, hey guys, I just here's, the, here's the funny thing. He's been getting all this stress and heat from his wife. Now he calls us. Now we're really riding him. He's gonna have to have a drink tonight. I, I know. I know. I love Jen's spots. I think the best. But everyone knows how you don't have the friends to get out him. yet. That's true. I know. I have rented stuff when we moved into this house. I did rent stuff um, from Home Depot to move. Ugh. Craig yeah, says, Craig says, right, I'm waiting for the guy. All right, let's see what we'll see what he says. Be hilarious if he's a reseller watching this, but no. I don't know why the resellers that watch this watch this. Nah, this is no guy to watch supposed this. to put up a fence is gonna watch this. <laughs> it's not about me, it's you. Yeah. That's well. The fence is up, and the late we already texted the adoption people yesterday, and they said they are coming out. So that's not a lie. See why is it? <sighs> what is that little picture? I can't see what Jen put. It's a little dog, I think. <laughs> we see why he's got a dog. <sighs> yeah. Oh, I don't think yeah. the dog before. So if he comes back here, I'll just open the front gate, and let the dog take care of it. <laughs> uh, let me see. Oh no! All right, the power the power adapter is on the screen right now. The actives are done. I was just actually good thing you're on the on the chat there, Tommy. Oh, I'm getting nervous again. Um, I got the Netgear Power 1000. Is that the one that you texted me last time or you uh, put in the chat last time? I think it was Netgear Powerline 1000. That's the one that's getting the best reviews. It's got 1,218 reviews. I don't know if that dog is worth it. <laughs> that's my own personal opinion. I don't even want to think about it. No, I mean, don't even, don't even. I don't, I'm not even, no. You, this is not going to get me down a rabbit hole of, oh, why am I doing this? Yeah. Doesn't it, see. <laughs> Mo, Mo, <laughs> Mo needs a Rottweiler. I do. I, you, you know, I'm so bad. I don't even use my own phone. Whenever I do these things, I don't, I use a Google line. So they don't actually know my phone number or my You're name or anything. such a wussy. So they don't even know my phone number. Like my phone number comes from like who knows where. It comes from like Milwaukee. Oh the speed God. is hold on. It says oh set up to two X PL ten. Hold on. Netgear Powerline one thousand adapter. What is the speed? Where's the speed? A thousand megabits per second. Is that it? Or uh, I think that's it. Let's see here. 
think that's it. We'll put it in the, the link is so long though. Let me see here. It's this guy right here. This is the mod this is the model number. Oops. Um, I can't even type, my goodness. I'm all flustered now because of this stupid text message. Ugh. Why do I care? Shouldn't care. Get over it. All right, all right cool. All right. It's in stock on May 6th. They're out of stock. Maybe I have a separate one, a different one that's similar. Let's see here. Oh no, they have some over here actually. Mm, yep, okay, cool. I like how you're motivating yourself out loud. I'm trying, I'm trying. Yep, PLT. Yep, that's. PL2. Oh, wait, is that the wrong one? Hold on. No, oops. There we go. Okay, yeah, actually, it was a different one. Yeah, yeah, okay, good, good, good. That one is in stock. Okay, good, good, good. The other one was not in stock. Okay, cool. One gigabyte kit or 1.2 gigabyte kit. What the hell is the difference? I guess the gigabytes. I'll go with the bigger one. Bigger is better, right? That's what. Uh, no, no answer. <laughs> I should think about these things before I say them. Still going strong, I see. Yeah. See if it's the same link. He still hasn't responded. Oh, I shouldn't care though, right? Yep, it's the same one. All right, cool. All right, buy it now. Ah, oh, it's one day, free shipping. Your order has been placed. Thank you to Tommy and everyone else who helped contribute to that. Oh, I'm on, I'm on mute. No, I'm not. No, you're not. Say, thank you, your order has been placed. I should get it tomorrow. March, when's March 30th? Tomorrow, yep, estimated delivery. I ribs. What I should be doing is getting a couple of things listed. I have all day for that, though. What did I just buy? I just bought a. Let me get the exact. A new fence guy. No, oh, that guy's about to rip me a new one. He hasn't responded yet. I have a feeling he's not going to respond. That's from his temperament. Listen. That's what I just yeah, bought. I can't even That's, say it without being. You have a. You're getting a dog, but you have that little Chihuahua that he's afraid of, and that not saying it in a bad way, but your yes. wife. He, he's afraid of the wife. I think. He's afraid. I'm afraid of my own shadow at this point. I'm getting better though. I was watching uh, Derek's video. I watched it twice. Which one? You didn't see his latest video. He's, uh, no. he's like a he's like a boxer. Oh no no! Up. I did see the one that he was renting in the storage unit yesterday. Mm -hmm. I he saw. Was like that. Oh, yes, I did. oh yes, I did see that. I saw that one. I saw it when I was at the flea market. I, I watched saw, that one a little bit before I uh, made the fence. It gave me the energy to make the fence. Yep. Seven years. When Derek gets upset, sometimes I think he's talking about me. I get afraid. I thought he was talking about me. <laughs> yeah. Is I like looking straight at the screen like Mo, you know what you gotta do. 
The funny thing is everybody always wants to know the the the, the reseller life, the thing the big thing in reseller life, everybody wants to know who's Derek Mann at. <laughs> he he's, he he drags us along. He's he's not mad at anybody, but he's just he's Derek's just, like the Pied Piper man. He's playing us, but yeah. he's right though. He's not. No, no. He cracks me up. And like, oh, was it me? Was it? Did you did you say something wrong, Derek? <laughs> no, no. Half the stuff I get from Fisters doesn't work lately. Oh, I hate when that happens. I had somebody leave me. I never get bad comments on Amazon. I got one because they said they they received the Mall Madness board game and it looked great. It worked great. But then some little, I think the stairs didn't work or something like that. But they didn't want to return it. But they just wanted to let me know that they didn't work. I'm like, what the hell? Just return the damn thing. Don't write a comment. So now I'm at 99.4% or something like this just because of stupid Mall Madness. You know what Mall Madness is, right? You, you you don't have a copy of that? No. So so your daughter is so they're doing school from home, like my daughter. Yes. And uh Friday, I went to go, I don't know, I went to go take out the trash or something. I went yes. I walked into the house and my daughter's has the computer on logged in for school, yes. the camera off, the volume off, and she's on a tablet playing roadblocks. I flipped out. <sighs> Sounds like my son. I flipped out. I was like, "You!" I said, "This is some kind of serious joke right now, right? This, this is a joke. This, this yeah. is this is funny, right?" I was like, "You shut that computer off now!" And then, and then she had gym class, and she was so bored. And she, I could tell, she was like, "Man, doesn't that crack was, you up? Gym class at home." They make them do exercises, and, but I was I was heated. Oh, get this! My son's even sneakier than that. You know what he did? This is how we didn't even we couldn't have told unless they heard it come through the speakers. He had the teacher's camera on, so you see the teacher, right? So you think he's in class, but he had muted his mic and muted his camera. So to us, it looks like he's in school. But what he didn't know is I looked over his shoulder and in the bottom left-hand screen, he had another YouTube thing open. Yeah. So I'm like, can't they hear that YouTube? And then he kind of looks at me and he quickly unmutes the teacher. And then you hear the teacher saying, Nico, are you there? Nico, 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 are you there? And he's like, oh, uh, and he's like, <laughs> so he had muted everybody, made it look like he was in class and he's watching YouTube. Yep, and my, my, do and my daughter, she so they in junior high school they have like a um <laughs> I'm sorry I'm saying it it's an assistant teacher but to me it's considered a hype man <laughs> she, the teacher <laughs> reminds me of a hype man she follows these online kids from class to class yes like certain grades and she can see everybody she's like she's like Jen she yes. has boards and windows open I could see in my head what's going on. And she's like the hype man, and she'll and she'll be like, you know, um, and the teachers. I heard the teacher say, "Hey, so um, Mrs. So and So, um, how how many kids have we still missing some kids?" And she goes, "Oh, those three, you won't see those. I haven't seen them all day." She goes, "Some of these guys have been in and out all day." And I said to my my daughter, I said, "Uh, you must be the in and out crew." And she looks at me. And she didn't say anything. That so was that this totally morning was when I woke up. This morning when I woke up, she was up and she didn't have her tablet near and she was focusing and she had a pad and paper. She this girl was scared. <laughs> she had a pad. I said, like, Do you even know how to use that pad and paper? Why you got that? Yeah. She, she knows that. I try to explain to her. My my whole thing is because of how my education is and how it's limited me. In life, I'm very. I'm not like. I'm not like. I don't want you to have. I just want you to finish school. That, that's all I ask. I just ask her to finish school. Just try to pay attention. You don't have much longer. You don't have a job. You get free food. You don't yeah. have to pay for rent. Just do what daddy asks you and just pay attention in school. I know you don't want to. I know your mother doesn't push you to do it. But when you were with me in my house, I asked you 
to pay attention in school. And I would love for you to follow this when you go back home with mommy. Yeah. It, it's about, to be honest, especially high school, junior high, it's just about being, showing up and completing it. Mm -hmm. It's not even about anything else. They don't get homework. They no. don't get homework. These no. days, it's like you, you get yelled, the teachers get yelled at if they do anything uh, overly to the, te to the school. Oh, sorry to hear that, Derek. His, his wife took the second shot yesterday. She had a fever all night. I've heard that. My, oh. That same thing happened with my mom. Well, she's only taking the first one now. But, yeah, she felt feverish for a day or so. And she said it hurt around, I guess, wherever they gave it, kind of her arm. where they got I, it. I didn't have that. Pro oh, there she is. What's going on, Miss Taffy? Howdy, howdy. You already got the first shot? I wasn't supposed to tell you. The hell, man! You got it before me. We're supposed to get it on the same day. Well, I went in, and they said, "Are you in the um, school?" I, I went. She scheduled it. The, my better half scheduled it. Yes. And we went, and they said, "Um, you're in the school system." Um, and I said, "Yes." I, I wasn't. Nobody told me. I, I didn't know I was supposed to lie. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I didn't know I was supposed to lie. Well, I, I mean, I think you're okay because you would at least with somebody else. Yeah, send out good vibes your way, Derek. I so I I feel that my first one, and we're all adults here, but I feel that my first one it gave me an upset stomach a little bit, like I couldn't hold anything in. And I'm still, uh, I'm still at the point where I is said, it a 24 hour thing. People are telling me it's like two, two, one to two days. You feel something, and then after it goes I didn't away. feel sick. I don't feel sick or anything. I just, okay. I just, my bowels are not the same. Yes. <laughs> Listen, if you can talk about how you're, I'm sure I'm gonna feel the same. Don't even worry. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I'm I'll kidding. send you a picture. Really. <laughs> There he is, the man, the myth, the legend. There we go. I've been waiting to see him for a while. What's going on, Julian? He got like 19 employees now. He's ordered six pallets. He's busy. He's got 17 warehouses. Yep. He's got a jet. Who knows? Second shot is a doozy. I haven't even got the. I don't qualify for the first one. Leroy got in there because he cut in a technicality, I guess we'll call it. But <laughs> well, I think it's. I, you have to prove you have to like have an institution that you're working there for. There is none of that. We I am the institution. I am everything. Maybe I can call my fence guy and ask him, hey, can you, can you get me in? <laughs> <laughs> you got a spot? Can you give me a spot? <laughs> Listen, if it's that hard to get this first shot, I'm going to start selling applications. Seriously, I, I don't know how to. Because I, there, I remember somebody sent me a link, something.ca, and then. I went to it, and then you fill out like a couple things, like where do you work and your age. Well, listen, we hey, we went to Cumberland Farms. I'm in Cumberland Farms. We went to um, CVS. Okay, you would, but you have to qualify in your state, though. California is so weird that if you're not, your wife working, already got it, right? Because she's in there. No, none of us got it. But isn't she in the medical field? No, she's right now. She's not working. So, oh, so that's what I'm saying. And the kids, right now she's mean, chasing around kids, the fence you know, guy. I'm sorry. She's chasing around the fence guy right now. <laughs> yeah, that's why. Yeah, that's half the reason I'm a hobbit right now because I haven't got it. And everybody else has got it around me. I feel like, okay, I'm the bad one now. I think my neighbor's got it too. Oh my goodness. Yeah, <laughs> fence guy's useless. <laughs> I feel bad. I'm sending bad vibes towards the fence guy. He's a nice guy. Chris, the fence guy. He's not even a fence guy, actually. He's more of a, like, he pretty much says everything. You're welcome. I'd be more concerned if you had no response since it's a natural response. Okay. See? That's a normal thing, Leroy. I, I wonder if Miss Taffy, she's saying she's nervous about getting it. I was. I didn't want to do it. I kicked and screamed. I hate shots, the period. The lady said to me, she's like, I'm so happy that you came. I said, listen, I said, I was kicking and scratching all the way here. I don't want to get the shot. I'm getting to shut her up. Are you scared of shots in, in general? 
I used to be. I'm getting better. When I got those quarter zone shots in the foot, there's not much worse than that. So, oh. Well, I, I it shouldn't didn't, complain. It didn't hurt. It never got swollen or yeah. anything. It just, I just feel that um, the other issue. I always complain about shots, and then my wife will just look at me and she'll say, "Don't you remember the? Ep Have you ever seen an epidural been given?" I've heard of it. It's like a half inch looking needle. It's like six feet long, and it goes straight into like the spine. Oh my goodness! I knew I had to take a seat after watching that. So after that, I'm like, I, I can't be a wuss. Tommy, I'm not answering that on this message. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What do you say? Hold on. I'm convinced it was last winter. I hate shots. I'm – oh, really? Okay. I don't feel as bad then. Did you use your 41% to get it? It's, it's down to 41% now, or is that up to 41%? No, he means yeah. something else. He means oh, something else. All right. I won't even go there then. Yes, nervous about shot. I hate me. I'm right there with you, Miss Taffy. I was the eight year old kid being chased around the doctor's office just to get it. Oh, wait, not eight, 11. When do you get your booster shot? 11, 12? I was being chased around the doctor's office to get the booster I, shot. I think tattoos are the worst. I got three of them and I hated getting that tattoos. I'll tell the only Why'd you get three of them? Because I was a kid. The only other oh. thing that hurt to me worse than a tattoo and Again, I'm just gonna be straightforward here. When when you're when you're black and you have the hair that we have, yes. If you get and when you get corn braids, and you're not, and you're tender headed, I thought I know some of you guys have no I, idea what's going on right now. There's people in here that will understand what I'm saying. I finish. And they start doing those corn braids when you're tender headed and you never had your hair corn braided. Man, that was the worst in my life. I would never do that again. Pain, like really tight on the top of your head. Yes, yes. That's why they do. That's why they do all the young kids. You gotta, you gotta get into their head young, because if you don't start styling their head young, then they don't get, then they don't get that, that like immunity type thing. You know, not immunity, not. but they don't get used to. You're not training the hair. You yeah, you're not training the hair. Yeah. Yourself. If you don't do that. They, they, it's very hard to to go after. And I, the first time I got corn braids, I was like nineteen. Man, that was the worst of my life. I was, it was hurt, man. I'm sorry. I know some of you guys can't relate, but trust me. I had long hair once, but I never. I don't really have. Yes, Tommy, I had corn braids. I did. I thought you called them corn rolls. I'm sorry. Is that wrong? Corn Is that rolls, a corn braids? Okay, same thing. Okay. No. Yeah, I tried growing my hair in high school. It didn't turn out well. I stopped growing my hair at 30. <laughs> Decided it wasn't a good look for me. Clean cut, man. It looks good. Especially with summer coming. I've heard, I mean, actually, it's the truth. If somebody knows how to give injections properly, you don't feel it. It's the idiots that kind of like, Start jabbing like they're, you know, it's a horror movie, and then that's the worst. I'm the one to not get shots just much. I would, I, to be honest, I never got a flu shot until they forced me to when my kids were born. How do we go from corn breads to cornbread? <laughs> cornbread is there, you go. Corn braids. Uh, later, I got corn breaded. He can call them whatever he wants. Yeah. And I'm a, I mean, how long does it take if to get a whole? I mean, getting their whole head done probably takes a while, too. Yes, Miss Taffy. If when they're heavy handed, oh, yeah. It, some people are fast. Uh, Mo, some of these hairdressers and they make some money. I think yeah. Miss Taffy said she did here on the side. Um, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it was you, Miss Taffy. Did you used to braid or still braid? No, they, hey, there's good money in that. 
they they they're doing these women's hair and they're making and they're making five some some places like you go to these big places they're making like three four five hundred dollars dude let's start one <laughs> <laughs> Le Leroy and Moe's breeding west coast to east coast they, they'll walk in and sit down and I'll say what do you want and they'll they'll tell me I'm like all right so wait hold on and I'll look it up on YouTube wait how do you Oh my goodness, this guy hasn't responded. All right. I'm Calm afraid. down. Listen, you're having fun. I just, about I just, yeah. A culture that you don't know much about. So who That's cares true. about right. him? I'm ignoring this guy. I'm learning about something else. I've Mo given a thousand, oh, I've given thousands of shots in 40 years as a nurse. Piece of kid. See, you probably have a technique to where you're confident too. It's not just confidence, technique, boom, boom, done. That's the best. It's the ones that kind of look a little bit like nervous. I'm the nervous one. I don't want the doctor or the nurse to be nervous. We we already got a name for our business. We do? What's it kind of yeah. called? Like I said, you'll see it in the comments. Oh, Regina does hair. We're going to need to ask her about that. I think I got my hair braided once when I was seven. Oh, man. I think allergies are starting this year. My nose is already gone. Uh, I got a big nose. Um, Yes, towels, chunk, snatch, ball, spots. Ow! Ow, ow, ow! Seriously, man. There it is. <laughs> Mo Roy's hair. <laughs> Mo, Roy, Mo Roy's hair, USA. Let's do it. Miss Taffy, if I came out, if you, <laughs> if you went to go get your hair done and I came out to come do your hair, would you jump out of the chair? <laughs> <laughs> I guess she like it, it, cause because she's from she's from our west. She'd be like, "Hella no, hella no." He ain't touching no. my hair. Uh -uh. No, no, be hell to no. <laughs> uh, we try, man. Seriously, man, we got to do it. But all, in all seriousness, though, Thursday, well, um, Leroy is gonna be on. We're all gonna be on twenty four hour madness. And I'm many, gonna. Try. I don't know what everybody else's plans are, but my goal, my goal. Oh, wait, I got one question for you. What time are we starting? I thought you said 4 a.m. 4 a.m. Pacific, so which is basically yeah. 1 Eastern. Are you going to be okay um, with that? Yeah, my me, it's 1 Eastern. You're going to be Is that not too early, though? Are you good? That's fine. That's fine. So I, already talked to the I already talked to the family. They, you, they were just happy I was getting out of the house. <laughs> <laughs> they want to know why it's not forty. They want to know why it's not forty-two hour listed child. Yeah, make it forty-eight hours. Make it seventy-two yeah. hours. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I said to Bianca, I said, "You gonna be okay?" She's. Oh my said, goodness. What happened? Telfer's comment. Ah, oh, I just I feel I feel pain when I see that kind of stuff. Bloody, sweaty, Bloody, sweaty hair. hair. Oh my goodness. I remember I tried cutting my own hair one time. I went looking for a Floby, if you guys remember that. I couldn't find one. So then I tried cutting my own hair. That didn't work. So I just got a pair of clippers and I just went G.I. Jane style. That was it. Give me a but they do. They, but they do. They, I know when my wife gets her hair done. Wow. It cost her about. It cost her about. Um, and then she goes to someone cheap. I don't think they do a good job, but it costs her about um, 190, and she has to provide her own hair. And that's cheap, you're saying? And that's cheap. I don't. I don't think they do a good job. Yeah, I can't draw that because she gets mad at me. Just imagine if she's even if you're like you know like ten people a day. The, the, it's hard. It, it takes it takes three or four hours. But the, some of those girls. So I had a friend that used to do it. Some of those girls are making are making anywhere from two hundred to five hundred a day, and they usually if they're hustlers, they're braiding here five days a week. That's a lot more than a barber shop. My oh, goodness, yes. barber shop. Oh, yes. You made like how? What's the most you ever pay for, paid for like anything in a barber shop? I don't. I hate. I, I'm still trying to learn. I love the atmosphere of the barber shop, and I always have, and I always will. But now when I go and it's almost thirty dollars for them just to trim my beard up, I have a hard time paying that. Cause I used to go all the time. When it was twenty dollars, 
it'd be like $18, $15. I gave him a five dollar tip. It was a twenty dollar bill out the door. I was happy with that. But that extra ten dollars now, I just don't I can't feel comfortable with that. Yeah. Do not let Moe or Leroy do your hair. <laughs> I wouldn't let anyone do I would do my own hair. I told you I have to use a pair of clippers and just get rid of everything. Tommy, yes, I did see that. I didn't look at it. Um, I was talking, but yeah, I'll look at it right now, Tommy. All right, cool. Thank you, Derek. You guys, I, I can't. I know it gets sickening hearing it, but you guys are so awesome to me and Mo. You guys really, really are. I thought you were talking to me directly and only me. I wanted to take all of that credit for everything. Mo, shut up and worry about the guy not messaging you back for the fence. Okay. Oh, why don't you have to remind me, man? You're still looking at your phone trying to worry about the guy. See, you know the, the dumb thing about Google, whatever you call this, messages? It doesn't say seen. You know when you look on Instagram, you can tell if someone's seen it yet or like a, a text. I can't tell if he's seen this or not. I just want to know if he's seen it or not. That's all. <sighs> all right, forget it. Oh, nice. I totally agree. I oh, Yes. Beautifully right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm good with that, Tommy. That's that's fine. Barbershop are about twenty dollars USA right now, plus tip. I, you know, I and since it's been probably eighteen months now, my wife's actually cutting my hair now. So she's good. She can pretty much learn anything. It's just the opposite of me, Derek. As soon as Leroy approves the thumbnail schedule. So you really are an agent. This is like a real thing. Yes. I mean, this is like he, like Tommy went to you to get the. Oh wow. Yes. A, yes. This is a real thing. Yes, and I and I even I even showed I even gave Derek some bull crap and showed I have him. A, I have a name for you. Instead of Leroy, should be L apostrophe agent like Lay Jaunt. <laughs> <laughs> I, I and I even I even showed Derek I showed him a nice gold chain and I said I showed him my chain and I said hey I said if you keep doing good and you do good for me one day I'm gonna get you one like this <laughs> one day you're gonna come up <laughs> uh, fifty dollars for my fade wow shape up and beard well I can't comp I, I wish I could grow a beard like that I told I I tried I can't it. It always looks like I haven't shaved, even if I've shaved, and I can't grow a beard. So it's like the worst of the worst. How long can you grow a beard, Leroy? How long? What's the longest? You my, can grow? my, because of my, I hate this. I don't know. I think it's because of just the mixture of my nationalities. Uh -huh. I can't get it too long. You guys have seen it. Um, you guys have seen it at my longest, like well, you know, one of my longest points. I can go like. I can go like four months and then it starts getting irritated. I get irritated, but it doesn't really grow much. It just how long is that good. right there? Um, I shaved it about two week, about a week and a half ago. I trimmed it. I've been trimming it down because I've get irritated I've after really about skin. a week ten I have days. Really bad skin under my beard. Yeah, I get like a lot of flaking and stuff. Yeah, um, it's like a dry skin type thing. It's not dandruff. You you actually see it on my shirt sometimes. I, it is what it is. Yeah. Um, and so I try to treat it with like oils, but I have a hard time. So sometimes I gotta trim it. No okay. Yeah, uh, we can do a thing. Well, um, we won't shave me the entire day of that twenty-four hour marathon and see who has a longer beard. <laughs> we won't shave the day. <laughs> I can probably. I'll probably have like a half inch by then. So you shave every day. No, I shave once every week to 10 days, something like that. See, this is from Friday. I think Friday. I think Friday or Saturday, yeah. My sister is her own shop and easily makes 100 plus a year. Nice. Small town, under 20,000 people. The four expensive expenses. <laughs> Tommy, we just need to um, we just need to do that in writing. I need you to make sure you have the Capri Suns, his favorite Capri, the kind that he likes. Yeah, I think Derek's getting antsy. He says Leroy approves everything. Yeah, yeah, it's twenty five to get my son's haircut. Yikes! 
Well, Derek, if you want to come over um, our new spot, we're going to also be slash beauty <laughs> slash barbershop. Um, which part do you want to do, Leroy? You want to do the beauty part or the barbershop? I think I'll, I'll do the beauty part. All right. That's uh, you guys heard it first. <laughs> He's going to do the beauty part. So his half of the store will be pink, and mine's going to be like not Mo colored, Mo cement Mo colored. Mo and Leona. Mo and Leona's here. Hair done by Mo and Leona. Oh. Hold on, hold on. No, here we go. No, you you guys don't know nothing about this. Okay, this again. Oh, no. This oh, again. So gotta, don't put a wig on. No. <laughs> here we go, Derek. How am I doing? Am I good? Don't ask me why I have it in the warehouse. Don't ask me why I have this in the warehouse. Why do you have that there? It, it was it was my daughter's when I used to get her hair done. When you okay. go to the, when you go to the Spanish places, if you're not if you're not getting if you're not walking out or going anywhere, they won't let you. If you're getting your hair straightened, they won't let you leave without one of these. They they twirl it up. They used to twirl her hair up, and okay. they put one of these on her head because they want it to look nice. So it's she, setting it kind of okay. Yeah. Yep. Got it. Payment bar thirty bucks, and that includes the tip. I think that's spend spendy. Never heard that term spendy. Okay, but he does a hell of a better job than I do myself. <laughs> when I do it myself, <laughs> I would hope so. But he's still crazy, Eric. If Leroy approved, my goodness, this is a real thing. <laughs> I'm impressed. Mm. Tracy, I, I don't you, know if you were listening in the background. We started a new business. We do here now. And yeah. yes, it, it does. <laughs> it does. Hey, you know if this does well. <laughs> I can't with you guys no more. Miss Taffy, I can't even look at you guys' messages. Just, I'm done. I'm done with you guys. Full cuts are where it's at. <laughs> Thank you. 30 to 40. <laughs> I can't, I can't do this no more. <laughs> Mo, you're not even down that far yet. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think I just read Topher's comment. <laughs> That's good. Can't draw a straight line with a ruler. No way I could. Nope, I'm the same way. Uh, I shaved my face recently, and she said I went from an egghead to a golf ball, golf all head face. <laughs> Oh, golf fall. There we go. Uh, hey, if it turns out well, we could start doing nails too. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're going to expand already, man. Think You got to think big picture. You can't stop. We can do franchises. We can go worldwide. <laughs> this will be big. Mobile. Mobile. Worldwide. <laughs> And, and so what's going to be no um, nails by nose? <laughs> it's a fence. It's a <laughs> I, I wanted to end the show at 12 o'clock, but you guys are cracking me up. I can't. We've go only been on for two hours. What are you talking? Oh, wait. No, we haven't. <laughs> How long have we been on? Oh, this is Oops Bad, part two. Okay. All right. All right. What can I say? Tracy, congratulations on your show that you guys are having with uh, Derek. So is this contract been signed then? Is it all? Yeah, we're good. As long as they have the Capri Suns for him. And I, I don't know, Do they? Uh, is Krillin doing a guest appearance on that one? You're not going to be like, you know, Puff Daddy? You're going to have to be in all the videos? Oh, there's is a right? question for me from Holly. Oh, I'm sorry. I gotta find it. I know she messaged me too. Okay, let me go back and find it. No, Leroy, you're not gonna be like Puff Daddy in the up, up in all the videos. You can stick your head in there. You know you're going to. Oh, he's reading. I'll let him answer. Yeah, I don't see. I see Holly, but I'm back. Yeah, if they're over a pound, I'm good. Oh, it was on your IG? Okay. Yeah. I and guys, if you message me on IG, I try I'm trying to do I'm actually trying to list today. So I'm trying to list, do the show. And if you message me and I don't get back too quick on IG, I apologize. 
Uh, I know Tracy. I can't say that word. It's hard. See, Tracy's already she's already signing us up now. What's going on? We're doing uh, what do you call them? Many petties. Now we're doing manis and petties. Yeah. That this is too much. We we gotta stop. We gotta. Can we stop? <laughs> now here's the thing. If we're doing hair and nails, right? Yes. When people get their hair and their nails done, is Cameron gonna walk with the pocketbook and do a little runway with a little twirl for us? We could bring Cameron. Cameron in as a did guest. you hear that? He could be like a guest appearance. Like yeah. he'll, come in, he'll come in with that pocketbook. He should. He should. Be. You can do that, right, Cameron? <laughs> I appreciate your apology since you ignored my Instagram, Leroy. No clue how to price those old tools. I'm just getting in trouble over here. I'm getting hungry. Messaging this guy back. No. Jerk. All right, whatever. I was just about to make a manicure. Oh, I don't even know what that is. Pedicure, okay. People's reactions to having the, the fish eat their feet is hilarious. I was watching my daughter. Was, have you ever seen that? You stick your feet. In this thing, it has these tiny fish. They look like piranha. I heard about that. Yeah. Oh, I gotta try it. Do a reseller version where you travel around and film it. That's a good idea, Cameron. I like the way you think. Uh oh, it must be the donut guy. It's not so beauty salon. <laughs> uh, Derek's a loose candy cam. Yep. That's awesome, Derek. Oh, it's cracking you up less. <laughs> Derek would be funny to watch him getting his feet done by those little fishes. I was watching that. My daughter was watching some show, and they had that in there. What was it? Some Disney show. That looks like it might be painful. I don't know. I, I think i got to try it, though. I have dry feet. Derek was yesterday's video preview of what's coming Saturday. Yeah, Derek needs to be pacing around with a hoodie on and kind of let everybody know what's up. When is this show? I believe, I haven't seen a thumbnail. I believe Saturday. Hell no, I can't let anything touch my feet. Uh, they're not just touching, they're literally eating the bottom of your feet. I accept your apology since you ignore my IG messages, Leroy. No clue how to price these old tools. I can tell you how much to price them for. Whatever it is, if you're not sure, put it at 500 bucks until you figure it out. Just get that listed. Good morning. Good morning. Simo, it will be epic. Sounds like Derek is volunteering as first tribute. Yeah, I think he, I swear that was a random video. I start to think about something. It pushes me to a point where I have to say something. That's the best kind because you're all hyped up. Let's get it out there. All right, what's this guy want? I sold a magnet to this guy. And I it, when I looked at it, it looks like a piece of wood. It doesn't even look like a magnet. So he messages me back. There was no magnet attached to this piece at all. Very disappointed. So I just have to message him back. I said, the entire piece of the magnet, it just doesn't look like one. But I guess he tested it out. Now he's okay. Jerk. 
What if this was Leroy? What happened? Leroy, did you buy a magnet for me? No. Okay. I, I sold this it. magnet to somebody. It looks like a piece of wood. It doesn't look like a magnet, but I tested it on the fridge and it works. So the guy's all, where's the magnet? I'm like, test it out, you jerk. Well, I didn't say that. I was thinking that. Dorky ass premiere. I like the sign of that title. It's a good title, man. I'm good without fish eating my feet. <laughs> Leroy, we got to do it, man. As part of, so we're gonna. This is the third part of our entrepreneur, you know, taking over the beauty empire. First, it's hair, then it's Manny's petties, and then it's little fish eating the bottom of your feet, so you get smooth feet. So. Moroy's smooth feet. Bye, Jen. Thank you for hanging out with us today. Oh my I goodness. appreciate it. Did I and finally get people, did I finally go overboard? And Jen, we have I have you scheduled for your hair appointment for next Tuesday at three o'clock. Why is nobody signing out with me? Holly <laughs> said a hard pass. <laughs> we lost the tool guy again. No, he's here. Uh, behind the chat again. Read the messages to us, Mo. We want to know what the fence guy said. Oh, that wasn't the fence guy. That was the magnet guy that got annoyed and then apologized. The fence guy has not responded since 8.38 in the morning when he, he sent me a message. Catch you later. Oh, okay. See you, Jen. How do you not understand how a magnet works? <laughs> I mean, I guess he looked at it and thought, okay, that doesn't stick to anything without trying it first. I'm like, yeah. So I yeah. sell so I sell some tools that have like they're like grabbers and stuff. Um for, oh, I, I have to have that if I have a screwdriver because I'll end up losing the, the bit otherwise. So what I do is I usually would take a picture of the magnet holding up like a socket or whatever. And okay. the sad the disclaimer is I have to say the, the socket is not included. It's just to show you the strength of the magnet. Okay, this is how bad some eBayers are. I sell little tiny action figures, and I'll put a penny next to it to show the size. Oh, yeah. And I have to put penny not included because I have had somebody that said, where's the penny? I had somebody say, where's the ruler? Oh, God, idiots. I had somebody say to me, where's the ruler? You didn't ship the ruler. And I said, I said if you... If you're serious, please send my item back and I will refund you your money. It's like, I mean, I know it's not the same, but you go to a store and the mannequins, the shirt's on a mannequin with a price tag. You can take the mannequin too. <laughs> <coughs> Leroy's fish feet. Oh, I'm telling you, that's the third phase. First it's hair, then it's many pennies, and then it's fish feet. It's all falling into place. But I don't know. Leroy's busy being a lay jaunt. Leroy's not busy. I put picture holder not included. Yeah. I put item not included. I should put item not included and see what <laughs> happens. <laughs> uh, what's wrong with some people? Frequent thought. Yeah, I don't know. Some people are just... Jerks, they're all jerks. How ironic, I'm about to get my nails done. <gasps> all right, have a good one, Miss Taffy. All right, Miss Taffy. Hey, send us a picture on Instagram. We want to see how nice they came out and let us know how much so Mo can start charging. Yes. And if it's a like a, a big guy with a Rhode Island accent called Leroy, I would probably get up and sit at a different booth. <laughs> Or batteries not included. I don't know. Maybe maybe that's Leroy's calling. Never know, man. Never know. My calling is no. I wish my daughter would. I've talked to my daughter about it. She don't want to do nothing. She's too young. Let her be in that. She's in the nothing stage. She's not even a you know a teenager yet. So. Let her yes, just, she just turned a teenager. She's 13. Oh, I thought she was 12. She just turned 13 February. Okay. Oh, she's barely a teenager. Come on. Listen, listen, here's the deal, okay? Yes. And I, and it is, I don't, you know, you guys know I'm a loose cannon anyway. 
my little girl became a woman at nine years old. So at that point, she's a, she she's a teenager. Okay. okay. <laughs> Oh, man, I think today's been quite productive. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> How many listings you got? Between us, you got you, you got one listing done? I think I got like six. So between us, we got six listings done? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but wait, wait, wait. We got six listings done. I disappeared for 40 minutes. You I disappeared for 20 minutes. Kids. We, we, made a, we wrote a letter to the... Uh, the, we wrote a letter Chris, the to, fence guy. to Chris. What else did we do? Because we we accomplish a lot in the show today. Oh, I, I turned off the feed without knowing it. I had to restart it, and then you forgot about that. We had to restart. This yeah. is part two. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. I did do two hundred relists, and I did order a uh, what do you call it adapter. You ordered the adapter. Yes, and the I did text Chris, and now he's ignoring me. And you and if you don't shut up about Chris, and you got and you got you got blessed or however you want to call it by some of our subscribers, and they sent that. I, that in all seriousness, thank you again for that. Seriously, I mean, and I, I will show you the Netgear thingies. I'm not not just making up. I'll show, when they come here in the mail, I'll show them to you. And I don't think if they didn't trust us more, they wouldn't do what they do for us. So, no. but. That being said, we can almost end the show at twelve o'clock, and I mean, in a few minutes, and we can. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm sorry, I'm taking up your time here. No, no, but I'm saying we've got so much accomplished. I don't know what well, everybody we, else has been doing. Hey, apparently we list more than Joey does. How much did Joe do? I don't know, but we did more than him, apparently. Oh, oh, I'm not even going to answer that question. Why he I'm doesn't list that much? I'm leaving that alone, Tofa. I'm a mad lister today. I've got half of one done. Hold on. Let me finish this. Mad listing. I'm changing, I'm, I'm changing it from just list to mad listing. I'm listing an $80 item right now. I'm excited. Uh -oh. One oh six red box square. That's uh, I like the voice. <laughs> you like that? It's like Mo listen more today. <laughs> uh, is, would it be cool if I um, add a picture of myself trying to open a fire hydrant with that thing? <laughs> hey. That's right. And we think we got we talked about tools. We got Leroy excited about tools for my. I bought a tool. That's big. I'm about to go and get some listen done. All right, All take right, it easy. Thank you. And congratulations on your uh, your show you're gonna do. We're, we're gonna make it, buddy. We're we're gonna make it. I got faith in you. I got faith in you. We're gonna I get will some, be there. I'm gonna get some more clients. We're gonna build this up. We're gonna start doing tours. I appreciate it. Toys. Tours. Tours. Jerk. We're gonna. Have... Wow. <laughs> Damn. We've got like so. Hold on. So we've got hair, beauty, nails, many pedis, fish feet, and now toys. <laughs> Holy mackerel, dude. <laughs> I don't know why these people watch us. I, don't, I have no idea. I'm about to list the Beatles. You're, scene, you're, you might get there one day. You might get it. You're not going to get my gold chain. I'll get you a small little rope one, start you off, make sure you stay with me. But I know what's going to happen is Tommy's going to offer you a bigger gold chain. And then you me. Holly, there is no answer to that. <laughs> that deserves a ding, Holly. Yeah. G.I. Joe's, Holly. G.I. Joe's. Right. I just sold the He-Man, he -Man's, Bobby Dowell's, Ken. Did I, did I show you the vintage He-Man that I had? It got sent back to me. I get to relist it. Hold on, I got to put you on mute. You can't mute me. Uh, YouTube Music, YouTube Kids, Creator Academy, YouTube for Artists. What's all this? All this is. Uh, 
<laughs> Leroy's do's. How about Leroy's do's and Moe's don'ts? <laughs> Uh, Mo, we're gonna look at the analytics and see. Um, have we been going up? Because I think we're we've a few times we've been hitting 26, 27. No, today we hit this is we're only once. I think that we hit like about a week ago, we had 30. I think that was the highest. This is probably the second highest, I'm guessing. It was a good show, though. Yes, I, I know we're still on live. I know we're still live. And I seriously need to get that thumbnail done and put that up and then. What are you what are you gonna use? Cause I, I was I was thinking of doing something too. Like this is not a joke. Yes. Uh, 24 hour listing challenge. Yes. Something like that, you know? Yeah, yeah. No, no. We could all because it's gonna be on three channels. Yeah. This isn't a one channel thing. It starts on one, goes to the next, goes to the next. And I'd so. like to I'd like to have our goals done by um honestly, I'd like to have everybody's goal list. In by, um, oh, I already have my goal list. I already told you, I told you uh, on air 50. 50 five zero. That's and my how, goal list. What's your hours going to be? You're going to try to do eight hours. Is that what you're going to do? Well, if I don't, okay, I'll put it this way if I don't finish my 50 and eight hours, I have to stay and finish it. We'll do it that way. Did you talk it over with your wife? I'm not trying to be a jerk. No, all right, maybe I have to find something. the right time to do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, after you tell her that the guy hasn't got back to you and you don't have to pay him, then you hit her with she that. She does not. No, she's normal. She She's like, so? Who cares? I guarantee <laughs> you she'll say, okay. She'll just shrug her shoulders like, so? I'm the only one that's worrying about that kind of stuff. I hope you have a schedule, Bo. I hope you schedule most portion for later than 6 a.m. Actually, the weird thing is I'm going earlier. I'm at 4 a.m. He's that's he's gonna go four a.m. I'm my goal is to stay on for twenty four hours. See, I the, might, whole, the whole I thing is if I went on at six, I'm then I would be going Pacific time would be six to well like two. So I'm gonna take out the whole morning. I need to make it so everyone it's a good time for everybody. So I get four. I'm gonna go four to eight my time, which is and then after me it's either gonna be Noel or Leroy, whatever they decide, um, and then. For eight hours and then you know the last person so that way you get a good part of the day everyone gets a good part of the day so you're gonna try to do 50 listings in your segment yes and you're trying to stay on for how many hours i'll try and i'm gonna be i'm not i don't think on the last 24 hours but i think i'm gonna keep coming back keep coming back as much as yeah. i can that's fine. I, I have a couch right gonna, there. I'm saying that you're going to try to stay I on. I have this right here. I don't know if you can see that. There's a couch right there. So that's most likely where I'm going to spend most of my time. Just like sleeping. And then like every couple of seconds, I'll just, you see my arm go, yeah, I'm, I'm still here. Yeah. And that'll be about it. Does that count? I don't know. I don't know if the dog might be here by then. I don't know. It might be too early, though. I'll leave it for us. No, that's fine, Cameron. Cameron, we figured that out. It's yeah, it's mainly gonna be um it's it's gonna be on Noel's channel, my channel, and most channel. Yeah, I'm we, kicking we, it off. And yeah, then we know that, Cameron. We haven't figured out the second or third because I know Noel and they I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna do it. I'm gonna leave that for Leroy and Noel. They'll figure out who's gonna be second and third. Because we didn't we mentioned it. I all I said is I'm gonna I would I would like to go first and no one wants to go first, so I'll go first. I, don't, I told you, here's my deal. My deal is I'm going to do five listings an hour for 24 hours. There might be a couple of points where I might have to leave for like 20 minutes or so, but my five listings are going to get done. Yes. Okay. So I, that I, within the 24 hours, I might take two or three 10, 15-minute breaks. No, I'm, we're, I'm definitely going to take some breaks. You have to take some breaks. So if most kicking but, but, it off, I can leave my reminder at the same time as normal. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, I'm going to have a copy of that link so I can, if I have to. Don't worry, Paul. Let me see. I'm going to, you know what? I'm, let's see here. I'm going to make a, let's go into Canva right now. 
Everyone needs a break. Exactly. Some more than one. Let's see here. What am I calling? What is the official name? What are we calling this? What is? What, what I would is say um, April Fool's twenty first. April Fool's twenty four. Ah, yeah, one of that. April Fool's twenty four hour listing challenge. All right. I think it's perfect because it's the day that everyone gets free listings. I'm gonna go against the grain and source for twenty four hours. <laughs> Oh, there you go. <laughs> there you go, uh, Tracy. As long as everybody stops in the chat and says hello and tries to encourage us, that's all I care about. I'm yes, not sir. doing it for nobody. I'm doing it for myself. I want to try to get 100 listings done in 24 hours, and I want to be able to be on for 24 hours, and I know I can do it. I know I'm going to fall asleep. <laughs> Hey, right. you know, get up. So, April Fools. Do I'm actually going to sleep on Wednesday. Like, I'm literally going to prepare. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to try to get eight hours of sleep in on Wednesday. I never get, I mean, I could try. But I don't know if that's going to happen. All right, see, so who are you calling? Let's see here. I need a picture of Noel now. Let me look up Farms Girl Scavenger. All right, listen, you want to end? Yep, let's end it because these guys are probably bored of us already. Yeah. Guys, great, 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 awesome, awesome show. Um, I appreciate everybody. Um, you guys don't have to do what you guys did, Tommy. And no, no. those people, I'm forgetting names. So if I'm forgetting your name, I apologize. Um, thank you for the buy me a coffees and to help helping us make the show better. Um, Jennifer, thank you. Tracy, Paul, Cameron, Derek. Oh, you guys, I hope you guys have a great day today. I'm not sure what I'm, but I'm, it's 24. I'm not sure what it is, but I'm in if it's 24 hours we're going to be listing for 24 hours on it on and off no no, no, no no i'll put a thing in no, no. we're going to be listing for 20 i'm staying here for 24 hours tim so i don't know what this guy's doing i know noel's got my back sleeping i'm eating. staying here for 24 uh, my goal everybody has their own goal they're going to come up to the table with my yeah. goal is how about this wednesday we come up with our goals and we have them on paper we write them out we celebrate wednesday the exact goals that's fine. I already know my goal. My goals are: I got to be on for twenty four hours. I might take a few small breaks. Yeah. And I'm gonna list five things an hour. I might take pictures of fifteen things, and then list fifteen things. But it, I'm gonna try to keep it as a ten, a five thing, five listings per hour basis. And I want so I wanted to get it. It's gonna be about a hundred, hundred listings. So I'm, I, my thing is, I want to do fifty listings. And it's an eight-hour show, so I want to be on camera for at least two hours. And then, um, what am I going to eat that day? He's <laughs> just messing it up already. We'll figure it out. Oh, you're going to do eight hours, so you're going to be missing for for six hours? I haven't thought of the excuses yet. Well, I'll, I'll come up with one. My kids are going to, I don't know. I'll pay them to come in here for a second. All right, guys. Well, everybody have a continue having a great day. While me and Take it easy. Oh, no. Is the fence guy. Is that Chris? Oh, Wait, no, it's not. Hold on. Stay. Get to it's the phone if it's Chris. It's not. All right. Oh. See you later, guys. Hello? It's Chris. Yes, ah, oh, I was just wondering. Um, I I bought all the supplies to do your fence, and now you're telling me that you're canceling. You know, I don't think this is appropriate. I'm a business person, and I'm trying to make a living here. And now you're canceling my job, and I just don't get it. It was. It is a guy calling from Oakland. All right, guys, have a good day. All right, take it easy, guys.